And... Alright, so it's all working. Good job. Alright, so, howdy D&D world with another episode. We should be on episode 8 if everything works properly, but... Eh, we've seen how that works sometimes. Anyways, so... Uh, the last game was kind of long, kind of everyone started drifting. Sorry about that, but just how it is. Uh, so, the party uh, decided to uh, take the dwarfs on the offer and uh, gather the d belongings and set out to the desert. Uh, as they did, they came across some dilemmas. Of, uh, some, uh, filthy dog people that, uh, ruined a majority of the, uh, oasis that is considered a landmark. And, uh, now they're kind of, uh, screwed on that. But, we all know magic is a thing, so anything can happen. Yeah, well, uh, something that did surprise me, though. As the players that did stick together all became melee. So they're going to have a little surprise in the game for doing that. I mm, wonder how what that's going to be. Uh, let's see. Anyways, so uh, first we can introduce the players starting from the top to bottom. Uh, yeah. Zio. What's up, everybody? I'm your lovable paladin. Nice to meet you. Lovable. Sounds like a dang panda over there. <laughs> Alright. Roko. Roko. I like, I like guns. Cheating people with guns. I like, I think it's a female character with a gun. Yeah. Also, Death to Israel, by the way. Oh my gosh. I'm a chief you one. I bought you food. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's supposed to be the other energy drink that no one talks about. Uh, Alright. Leo. You got anything to say, my boy? Alrighty then. Uh, Vox. Yes. Well, would you like to say anything? Hmm. Um. Not right now. All right. I don't have a lot to say. Yeah. So much right here. It was. Leo, now you're going to speak. Sorry, my my uh, phone did some glitchy stuff. It's alright. Leo, what are you going to say? <laughs> he broke his phone again, apparently. Alright, it's alright. Anyways, uh, as he's fixing it. So, we last ended the game with the party wrapping up the combat and Leo, Cole's character, is collecting heads and stuffing them in his backpack, which are dog people. And I didn't want to continue the roleplay until the next day because anything can happen on changing that up. So, uh, that's where we'll be picking up. Well, what's, um, not to be bare of bad news, but the water seemed quite, uh, unfair. What the hell do you guys do? I, I, I was, I was going to come for, for five minutes, so you got to come back to see this bullshit. What the fuck's happened? I mean... It was nothing that we could control. We tried to uh, take out the gnolls before, uh, at least that's what I believe they were, before they could contaminate the entire 
a pool of water? I guess so. Next time, I'll come. Next time, I'll come out. I'll come with you guys next time because I'm a fucking slow bro. <laughs> so, uh, do we just give up on fresh water? We all know how long it would take us to get uh, to our destination, right? Uh, roughly. But to be to be honest, we can we can still technically drink the shitty water. We just need to boil it. Technically speaking. So. Uh, so uh, uh, it just, it just, it just, it just it tastes fucking disgusting, but I'll probably, no, it's just drinkable. Uh, some side notes. As uh, Roko's character walks up, uh, he begins to smell a, a different smell from the other four, four party members. That they stink. They stink, huh? Yeah, they stink. God, you guys fucking stink, by the way. Take, take a shower. Okay. <laughs> uh, um, that's uh, quite... Charming of you to uh, say. Um, I have no clue how to go take a shower at this moment. Maybe once we get to the town. Maybe yeah, but uh, I'm obviously like you know, ten feet away from you guys. So there's such distance on that. Stay away from you because you're starting to stink. But yeah. Um. So yeah. Uh, how how we fucking fix this thing? Because uh, the, I mean yeah, like I said, it's not technically drinkable. Is what just need to boil it. Um. So yeah, we can do that. We can boil the water. Otherwise, I don't see a way to fucking save this this oasis because it's done. Unless it was any horny magic. So, yeah. Oh, well. No one has holy, holy magic. But, um, I may be to, uh, try something. I'm not sure if it'll work. And he, like, uh, pull out this, like, this vial, whatever, just to pretend like he, uh, you know, not use magic. Oh my oh. gosh. So, oh. you can add the roll deception. Okay. Uh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, and is it verbal? Oh, okay, not bad. A plus four is not bad. Is it verbal, somatic? Uh, what is the spell? Uh, let me go check. <laughs> it says... Oh, verbal. <laughs> See, yeah, I like to see how you pull this one off as you roll. Right. This so search. he like go to like the the furthest end that he can away from the party. Um, let me let me roll, roll. Hey guys, I need to take a shit around the bush. Please don't look. <laughs> ah. uh, uh, my deception was. Uh, horrible as a seven. Yeah, but they don't know uh, that unless they say something or want to roll against it. Do y'all roll against um, it? Well, so far, nobody want to roll against it. And he's going <laughs> to like, put the uh, bow into the uh, water with his both hands. Uh -huh. and then he's going to like um, praying at the same time just to purify the water. But he's whispering it as low as possible. <laughs> There ain't no such thing as whispering in spells. But I get you. And um so, and he would start to try to uh clean clear the water clean the water using the, the little fake magic or whatever. Then what do you whisper? I wanna know what you're saying, what do you whisper? So now then I know what you're anytime you say that statement, you're casting that spell for the uh, audience. Uh, uh, Bless this water, oh mother. And purify it. Mother. And and that's what's gonna go on and then I, I assume that it'll start to clear up. Come on, we're assuming I'm here. You hear me now. Yeah, Grim. Yeah. Can I, can I, can I, can I inside, Grim? That's why I said if anyone wasn't rolling against that. And what are you casting? Oh, can you hear me now? Hello. Yes, Leo. Yes, yes Leo, you, we hear you. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, yes, I've been saying one against that, yes. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, so far, uh, Zio's still passing. Yeah, so far. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> he's, got, he's got to pass two, two rolls now. He's got to pass my roll and his roll. Uh, oh, your roll well, box, let's see in box. I mean, they don't, y'all don't have to. Y'all can accept whatever he's doing. I just think it's. We cool. could, but that was fun as well. Okay. Uh, well, I mean, he's a freaking bird. I mean, all he has to do is fly up and stare at you. 
technically true. Yeah. Uh, I have a, a bird eye view of everything. <laughs> Uh, so, okay. you got your roll now, Leo? No, I'm gonna need my my character sheet. It's not working. Mm mm mm. See, this is I know. all right. So it is pinned, pinged, pinged, pinned. If you look in uh, direct messages. Yes, sir. All right, and then click the little pin button. And it should be the very first one. Oh, we got a pause live on deception. Wait, he's not rolling deception. It's I'm an insight. And do I need to ping it again? Yeah, I don't see a little pin button. Uh, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. The little pin button. It goes call, video. Pin, pin, add person, and it shows you on or offline search under your name and my, like me and you, or me and you privately text. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it. All right, that's where your character is saved. Right. See, and this okay. is why I always say, send me your character, so I got them. Alright, and I'm, what, 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 uh, if the you're, perception? Are you trying to see if he's lying? Then it would be an insight. Hey, what if I'm trying to see what he's doing? You already can see what he's doing. He's dipping a, a vial in the water. And he's, yeah. Alright, so it's an insight? Yeah. Yes, sir. Alright, roll now. Alright. Explanation R. Explanation R1. Space, then 1, D20. D20. Yeah, I got it. I got it on. Yep, it's and then, then plus whatever your insight or minus. Why is your insight so high? It's got a plus 5. He's probably proficient. Uh, so what do you two do? We'll start with Leo on being top of the VC order. Uh, what do you do about knowing that he's lying? Well, I'm not going to say anything. I'm just going to make a mental check for myself to know that he's a deceitful person and uh, just keep my mouth shut knowing that he A, uh, is a magic user and B, that he's deceitful. <laughs> All right. Uh, Vox. Knowing that I can do magic myself, I'll just be quiet. <laughs> okay, so there you go. Zio? Because... Yeah? Because technically my character can talk to spirits, so that's technically still talking about magic, so... <laughs> he doesn't know that. Yeah. He, he, he doesn't... So, Zeo, to your mental note, everyone believes you. Anyway, anyways, he, uh, that that should that should do it. Um, uh, um, this blessed um uh, water that um that I was given. To cure, cure this little problem that we was having. Yeah. And you're, okay. you're casting so, uh, cure, uh, so, purify. So, so theoretically, theoretically, Zia, we can we can drink this water now, right? Or do we still have to boil it and do all that greatness? Oh no, it should be fine. It should be fine. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah, well, 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 Zia, take, take the first sip, my friend. Yeah, you uh, go ahead, mate. You, you, you can... Uh, you know can thing. Uh, I'll gladly drink a uh, uh, sip. And he, uh, he, like, stick his hand uh, in the water and um, <laughs> he pour, like, a handful in his mouth. 
it's good enough for me. I'll, I'll just take off swimming. I'm, I'm gonna go and and start swimming and try to wipe off some of this rain. <laughs> oh my god. So, y'all would as the uh, like seconds and blah blah blah. Y'all would notice that the line of clean water. So like, it was the dirty water. Yeah, the dirty water. But imagine mm-hmm. it like a ripple of just becoming cleaner and cleaner and cleaner into it. Whoa. That's what y'all would okay, see. The plants the plants uh, are still uh, dead though. Five of the dudes here. Uh <laughs> Um, so I guess, we, I guess we'll stay here, right? For a little bit. Yeah, are we in agreement with that? Alright. I think we're supposed to be meeting somebody here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so I think that's, that's so camp, and I'll, I'll take the last watch. Well, technically, it would still be the first day of arriving here, so it's not that. It was just uh, combat. Uh, it's more. Uh, uh, I guess it'd be a subject brought up the next day if y'all want to stay in quotations. Yeah. So, okay, I guess we'll be coming then, yeah? Yeah, uh, I, I see why not. Right? Yeah. Why not? Because the boogeyman, uh, no. if, we're, if we're here, if we're here to, to wait for... Who, who are we supposed to be waiting for? Why are we here? No one. Some You're not supposed to wait for no one. And just... You're supposed to so, continue the trade agreement. Morgan, like I said, it's, it's, a, it's a delay. Not, not, a, not a stop to that, so, you know. It, it, it no, why are you telling... I'm telling you as death, because death ain't here. Oh, yeah, that's right. Beep. You asked, why are you here? That tells you. What? Beep. That thing is actually heavier than what you're moving. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I'm just saying, that's literally a, a, a small person, because it is a small person, a small person, a medieval RV. <laughs> it's got a, it has a room and a kitchen and stuff like that. Hey, hey, Vox. Hmm? What's that? You. Uh, I mean, uh, Thread. Yeah, Thread. That's, that's the guy. Hey. Chicken yuck. Thread. Sir. What's a chicken yeah. Whoa. My dear, uh, what can I do for you? Sorry. Are you strong? Are you, are you a strong individual? I have, I, have, I have an idea, and I need your help. Oh, my God. Okay, I could try it. All right, so here's my idea, okay? I want you to fly me as high as you can so I can do a backflip into the water. What? Yeah. Uh, Okay, let's find out how well I can pick you up. Oh, what's your strength? Uh, strength. Vox, what's your strength? Hold on, my strength. Yeah, what's your strength? Not, yeah. not the modifier, the actual number. <laughs> Plus one. So is that a twelve? Is that twelve or thirteen? Even with the modifier, still plus one. No, I know, but is it a twelve? Is it a thirteen? Oh. Uh. Strength. Oh. Yeah. Statistic. Yeah, the actual stats stat, like 10, uh, 10, 12, th- I think it would be 10. That's either 12 or 13 if it's a plus 1. Okay, so armor class, I am 11. No, 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 your strength, your actual strength statistic above your yeah. dexterity statistic. I've been looking for that and all I can find is... It just says plus 1 on, on my end, so I don't, I don't know. What sheet are you using? Uh, are you using the, the, the actual 5 sheet? No. What's, what sheet is you using? I have a sheet, Dennis. Uh, I think it's the one you're using. That app. Uh, okay, scroll, uh, scroll, scroll, scroll to the middle where, where you're below the notes. Oh. 
blow the notes. Yeah, so you blow the notes. Yeah, so, so you see, so you see your AC and all that shit. Screw down to your ability modifiers, which is below that. Below that should be ability modifiers, right? See, so strength. No, I'm still looking for that. So I'm trying to find it. Yeah, you good. But it's well, either 12 or 13. Ah, uh, I mean, it wait. Assumes a, a 12? It assumes, a, assumes a 12, right? For brevity. Until we find out. Okay. Um, yeah, Alright. So, Leo, what is your character? Uh, does your character have a weight on there or no? Yeah, give me one second. Speed, armor class, hit points, hit dice, efficiency. It's not really a roll thing, it's more of how much can you carry without having... Um, uh, without um, being overbearing. Well, him, uh, the Birdman. So the Birdman no. can carry 180 pounds, and anything beyond that, uh, he can't get off the ground. Alright, okay, so I can, uh, lifting and carry is 195 pounds, max is carrying capacity is 390 pounds, pushing or dragging is 390, max is lift 390. Uh, it would be under uh, height, weight, skin, age, shit like that. But you don't really have one underneath there. Uh, shit. Alright, hold on. This is why I have different notes. Google, Google, Google. Da, 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 da. Jeez. Out of game, I just realized I'm rich. So boy, man. So boy. Alright, so. I, I legit thought I only had like 10 pieces of gold this whole time, but now I'm looking at the character sheet and it says 690 gold pieces. I'm like, wait, hold on, huh? So this, uh. The first two, uh, is average, and then you roll. 2d12 for your height, and you would add that, and a 2d6 uh, goes towards your weight. So, roll a 2d6, which I am guarantee is going to be way more on your lifting just by... Here, I'm just doing it like this. Oh. Uh, hold on. Hold on, hold on. I'll just do it. How uh, heavy can. Uh, that doesn't sound right, but. Zarek could be anyway. Okay. How tall is Captain Dion? 8, 19. He can only lift 130 pounds. Yeah, how, how tall is the character the young? For 180. How tall is uh, Give me a second. He doesn't have none of that. Okay. Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. Just give me a second. It says zero on all of that. 2D. I mean, just the species alone is worth an entire. Give me a second. So his, his character is 6'2 six, six plus 15 inches, so 7. One seven three. Medium size, four foot seven, one seventy two pounds. Mountain dwarf traits. Okay. No, you're a fur bog, not a mountain dwarf.
You see it now? No. I'm still looking at the same thing. Now, now I'm confused. I'm looking at what you pinned. Oh, well, anyways, so a verbal medium is starting at base height is 6'2". Then you take a 2d12 and you roll that and add that. So it's 2d12 plus 15 inches. Uh, I don't remember. I think it's like 15 times. Uh, six, seven, hold on. So, uh... A six two plus fifteen inches. That is seven five seven five. And I think after that is what four five six seven times fifteen. I think that's how it's done. Yeah. And then you would add a uh, hundred and five pounds to hundred and sixty. So, he weighs 270 pounds. He, you weigh too much for him to take you off the ground. So. 90 pounds more than he can carry. And that's not even counting his equipment. So you give him the idea to pick you up and throw you in the water. Do y'all want to describe what happens as he tries to pick you up or you try to get picked up? As, uh, as he was trying to pick me up, his grip would slip and I would just fall face forward in the, in the sand. Silly. Right, silly, 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 silly. It's all good, man. It's all good. Yeah. The sand doesn't taste that great for me. That is the second time he failed on picking somebody up, you know. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty, pretty weak for a bud, bud. <laughs> <laughs> I bet if he held a rock up and dropped it on your head, it wouldn't be so weak. Yeah, true, true. <laughs> That might be plausible. My bones are halo. As in... You don't know halo, so fair enough, bird man. Well, um, like I said, let's, let's get captured up and then we can fucking, you know, rest. Because right. I understand you guys were fucking damaged as fuck fighting those guys. <laughs> So, uh, I guess the best way to put it is, so other, other members would come out of the wagon, and all they could say is, man, what is that smell? They don't fucking stink, man. Holy fuck. They do fucking, they fucking stink. They do. Okay, you, I just took a bath in a lake on Elisa's thing over here, so... I mean, Segregate, segregate the bathing area of the fucking drinking area, man. You don't want piss. Yeah. Segregate, segregate the bathing area. That thing. This is a bathing area. Yeah. Everyone else, drink. This bathing area. Someone fucking wall it off or some shit. Uh. So the sand wall, man. Don't contaminate the water. Exactly, man. Fucking disgusting. Gross people. Uh. Maybe not just this contamination. The bird, yeah. And then you and then you put your sweaty balls in there and exactly. dirty it again. A separate area from the drinking water. I don't want to drink taint. <laughs> Man. You know what? You know what? You know what? Oh that. I apologize. All right. I'm sorry. No Peace. Fine. Yeah. All right. Fine. Just. Bathe in the segregated area of the, of the, of the oasis here. Water off or some shit. Water off. Um, no, I didn't want to sleep. I, 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 you, know, you said we stunk, dude. 
I didn't want to stink anymore, and I just figured since, you know, homeboy over here, okay. he, okay. he well, cleaned I, it once, why well, couldn't he do it again, you know? I, I guess so, but okay, I, I, I'll, I'll say, I'll say the over, but I still think we should segregate the baby over from drinking over here. I, 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 I can't clean the water again. I only have one bottle. <laughs> I have to go collect more. And he, like, gives shifty eyes. Oh, yeah. Right. So, when Leo was taking a bath, uh, the halfling was digging in his bag. So, as he, uh, he hands, uh, then he looks, as Leo comes out of the water and tells you what Leo was telling you, uh, the halfling looks at Jaw and say, It's your stuff. It stinks. Your stuff stinks? Yeah, true. Oh. I think it's you, but it's your stuff, man. Hey guys, wait a minute, wait a minute. What, 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 uh, what, what did we just fight, right? What, what, what were these things? Dog people. Do you want dog people with ghosts or some shit, bro? Yeah, I, I mean, yeah, but what, 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 what did their effects do around the, what we just did? Can, can anybody describe what the effects were? Mm, the Holy Night would say nothing. They don't do nothing. It was planned and pretty sure poisoning the water supply. Yeah, but you're asking. That ask part, yes. Yeah, yes, but you po they poisoned the water supply. But they don't do don't that. You see, the dwarf tells you they don't do that. I fight those things. Yeah, but Kitty, those ones did. <laughs> As you can Kitty for yeah. you. I mean, they, they were good until they showed up. Now, now, just hear me out, all right? I didn't. So, uh -huh. everything was great and groovy before they showed up. They show up, now everything stinks. The water supply was poisoned. Those plants over there are dead. Don't know why. Uh, yeah, I, I, uh... Check you guys' water. Wait a minute. Uh, if that water was was rotten, wouldn't w w could that not transfer to our water that we have in our supplies? They weren't too close to us. Okay, but they weren't too close to that plant over there. But that bush is dying. Yeah, exactly. Not dying. Chico, not dying. Chico, dead. Chico, it's not dying. Chico, it's Chico, okay. It's dead. It's dead. <laughs> uh, just split. Can you go check your supplies, please? Yeah, check your water. Maybe, maybe, maybe your water's fucked as well. You just watch the... Maybe, you watch the... Wait, some... Can you check the pockets of the creatures? Of the dark, oh, dark creatures? <laughs> well, well, as y'all would be doing whenever some of the party members, NPCs, they'd be walking backwards just in case something explodes. They're like, no. No, I want to fucking get way the fuck over here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just clarifying. Nothing's going to happen out of game. But they don't know that. Uh, in game. See what's going on there. Yes. So the halfling tells y'all, y'all stuff stings. And Birdman says, it's not me, it's the. It's the dog people. Okay. So let's see. Pour out, pour out, pour out the water in the, in the rations. Pour it now. Pour it out. The water. The water skin. He would do what he would do what he was told and pour the rations. And they, the holy man would say, "Why would you pour it out? You're supposed to sniff it first, not waste it." Ah. Uh. No, Here, take out. a bite of it. You you tell me. Pour it out. Yeah, exactly. Here, take a bite of it. You tell me if it's any good, sir. Go ahead. Why? Take a bite out of what? You're the one only pulled out your water skin. Okay, well, take. Listen, <laughs> alright? Poison is poison, and I'm not taking any chances. If you want some of this water or this food, you go right and have it. That's, uh, that's all you. So, you. so you. Well, you poured the, the water out. But you take the food and start eating it. Yum, yum. Pretty damn good to me. Oh, 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 just was basically this is, this is the point. Exactly. So, yeah. <laughs> but y'all don't know that. But he eats Hopefully. it like it ain't nothing. Halfling, try, try some, try some of the rushes, halfling. Uh, uh, My uh, character palms his face as he realizes something. What? Did we just have left the tavern a few minutes ago? Well, not yeah, well, oh, day, town. days ago, days ago, but yeah. Yeah, it was, it was days ago as well. Days ago. 
Well, I just have realized what if there was bounties on posters up? Yeah, so, on, a, on a hairy person. What about yeah. it? Hold on, hold on. Zurich, Zurich would uh, reach into his yeah. bag. Um, his pillows was part of a bounty. What, these things? Zuri would reach into his bag and pull out one of the severed heads and look at the severed head holding it by the hair and, and talk, Hey, do you have a bounty on your head? So you gotta cast I this. mean, he, he, he's being sarcastic. He, this isn't a cast. This isn't a role. This <laughs> is just him playing a sarcastic role. Alright. Uh, well, the holy man uh, would tell you those things. We just killed them to... Not as a bounty, but more as, uh, you get paid for, uh, killing them, but it's not a bounty. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. It's not, I'm not explaining it right. Because us country people, we kill hogs. And we get paid by the state for every tail we bring. So, the best way, I don't know how to explain So every orc and gnoll... He would kill, but they would say dog people and tusk people. <laughs> you take in their heads and you get paid for it. I can't just take in their ears and, and show that as proof enough? Well, uh, out of game vindication always collected heads and just brought them to them. And now that's all they do is just collect the heads and smell the rest of the time as they carry them. <laughs> There's. I'm not saying you can't. I'm not saying you can't. Uh, I mean, a simple, hey, this is a dog person, uh, can survive, but Vindication never did that. I don't know why I'm looking at this. Because you, you have a year of dog person. You see, you have to get it from somewhere, and it's obviously still have blood on it, so it just, you know, it sparks me. It's, it's odd. Well, you also have witnesses. It's some vouch that this came from a dog yeah, person. That's, that's fair too. Yeah. Anyways, uh, what's the plan here? What are we, what are we doing? Well, you, you, people stay for video. And y'all are gonna check y'all's stuff, cause y'all stink. All of your belongings stink. Stink, stink, stink. And then they step backwards. What? 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 Listen, you you say stink one more time, stink. I'm gonna throw you in that in that in that pond over there. Oh, who are you? That oasis. Throw who? Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Who are you threatening to throw? Whoever says stink again, the next person that says stink. Okay, so we get we get that we have odors. Okay, yes, guys, we stink. Okay, we we are gross. We are, we, we we get that. Our, our, we're we're nasty. Okay, can we please move on? Okay, yeah, fine. Whatever. No, 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 no. He's a happling. So no, this makes his day. You're <laughs> uh, He's an happling. He always believes in the bright side. Uh, but your stink can run away the monsters as he'd run. <laughs> As he would, as he would go, Thorman, Thorman. as he would go to the Minotaur. Uh, I like him. I like him. He, he's he's cool. Uh, okay, yeah. I I guess we I guess we get to making the the sand tra over here uh, to segue the fucking bathing area from the drinking area. I want to want to bathe in peace. <laughs> Pay them, please. Oh. So no one cares that their stuff stinks, gotcha. Well, they care. Well, I don't know. I like making those sandwiches. They can be. I have three rotting corpses and or heads. Eight, four rotting, four, two, three corpse heads and like four things of bones in my thing. Why would I care if it stinks? All right, yours doesn't. You don't care, but what about the other uh, Birdman and uh, Zio? Well, uh, it doesn't. It doesn't particularly bother me. Oh. What does that mean? 
Why, 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 why is that Pokemon in the background? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, oh, my phone. Oh, my bad. Oh, my bad. So you're just like. Alright, well, um, anyways, yeah. yeah um, would, would it bother you guys if, like, my things stink? Because I have, you know, rotting heads in, in their carcasses for the things that we just chopped their heads off at, you know? So it's going to stink, it's rotten meat. Not yeah. mine at all. I have dealt with a little bit worse before. Yeah, but they also. Uh -huh. But Zio, Zio, Birdman, and Death also stink. That their belongings, their belongings stink. So even you have a different kind of smell. Yours smells like death, mm. but theirs smells rotten or like uh, stinky feet. There you go, stinky feet. A rotten part that you just specified. So my God. What do you suggest that we do about the, uh, wretched smell, anyway? Look at your stuff. Yeah, look at your stuff, and, uh, take, take a bath in the little, little bit of the stuff you have for you. Oh, what? I see what I and, and wash your clothes. And your clothes as well. Uh, uh... So you're also gonna look now? I got, I got nothing. No. So are you gonna go looking around in your stuff? I am looking around in my stuff. All right. So, uh, you would also notice that your food is caca, and uh, your water smells. Oh. Okay. I'll I'll, I'll uh throw it away. Throw it away? No. It no. <laughs> But it, it's, it smells like caca. That's food. Oh, I thought caca. Kills the water as poison. You, 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 know what, you, know, you know what, Mr. Dwarf? What did, what, what did you trade with them? You Tra trade your food for their food. I'm not trading my food with their food. They're, they should not waste the food that they have. Sheesh, you're in a desert. Yeah, yeah, but the food is shy, though. They can't eat it properly. If I can eat it, they could eat it. I can guarantee, I can guarantee anyone else here who's not a dwarf. <laughs> How would you know? <laughs> well, I know. I know. I'm just going to smile. <laughs> uh, the most they'll do is give you the shits. You'll live. Oh, uh, yeah, fuck that. <laughs> I don't, I don't think... I do. I don't eat for you. I'm gonna fucking die. I don't eat. Uh, so y'all, you know, if, if it means anything, you know, uh, dwarf meat is very high in protein. Yeah, uh, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll just, I'll just uh, rack, rack the slide of my rifle. Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> it's not that great. Oh, don't worry. Man. So the question is, what what will y'all do with your? Well, I understand the water. But what are y'all gonna do with your food supply, y'all? Because are we out of character right now? I'm asking you. I'm asking you. Yes. What are y'all going to do? That way, I know. I say, if it gets real bad, we resort to cannibalism. I mean, I mean, uh, it's just it's boil nature, but you, I, I, theoretically, if you even boil, even boil that shitty food, you can you can technically still eat it. But I mean, um, it's a shit though, but it's, it's not eat it. Why would you eat it though? If you need to throw up, you're wasting more calories throwing it back up than you would doing yeah, it. If, uh, yeah, but the, the, the logic here is, is that if it's boiled, it, 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 it would be sterile technically, and it's all food technically as well. Can you what? I, uh, you know, uh, cut some food from. Like some meat from the nose. Fuck that. You want to eat people? Whoa. Um, Wait a minute. Hold on. Hold on. Is that is that a Bible thing? Like, could we? Yes. Like, but we... yes, you can. But the uh, no. But those cause this thing. That is those some pause things. right there. That that surprises these people. This is um. Uh, I, I go that this uh. Unorthodox, but you you know anything to survive. I mean, I like rules. I'm I'm actually in agreement with with this. What's your all's alignment? No, what is y'all's alignment? 
What is the L2's alignment? My gosh. This will be a terrifying thing for me to say, but can no, I go no, What do you all mean? What's your alignment? What, what is my alignment? What do you mean, what is my alignment? Oh, okay. Chaotic, alignment? lawful, like, neutral. Uh, and what were you saying, Box? Been, Hold on, let's go. What was Box trying can to I, say? I to go out and search for food. In the, in the desert. In the desert, desert that's... Yeah, like desert, desert. Like, there's nothing in this desert but sand. The, the, the water, the plant matter was your food supply. If you well, want to... Like, if you're a like, vegan. If you're a vegan. Those flood plants. There are rapids that can survive in the desert. Camels that can survive in the desert. Coyotes that can survive through the desert. But the, if they can survive through the desert, so many... You have to think of this kind of desert that only rains once a year. Oh, once a year. That's a problem. Then my... Alright. Now I got you a painted picture. That... Uh... I have to... Sh oh, yeah, I'll have to show you the world map again. The continent is literally a desert. The only thing that's not a desert is the world, because it's a planet. But it is technically the continent. Uh... The only thing that has plant matter is literally just, like... A I think it's like 90 miles inwards. Some has more, some has less. Of plants. Anything beyond, I think, 90 miles is literally just desert. And y'all are in the desert. So, and all it is, right? So, what alignment are you? I'm still looking. Well, Zio. Oh. Yeah. What's your alignment? Uh, chaotic good. Oh my goodness. All right. I don't know. Hey, hey Krim, what about time? What about what time to shoot the the corpses after they after they? Well, that's not that. Yeah, that's not that big of a deal. I'm not worried about that one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's not what I'm worried about. Two people are suggesting eating intelligent humanoids. Excuse me. Oh, they're humanoids. That's why I call them dog people. And even the the dwarf keeps calling them. They're smart. They're not dumb. So y'all are eating humanoids. Technically chaotic. Through the freedom of an individual to act independently. All right. So I guess technically, yes, you can eat uh, people. Well, he can, uh, the Zio. Uh, now, Leo. Do I know? Are you just saying that just because of him? No, like, I'm, I'm a fucking necromancer, my guy. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, collect heads. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, I get you, but there's also... Let's... You gotta be, uh, evil if you collect them. Heads, exactly. I'm, I'm over here collecting heads. Like, who, who does that for, for goodness? Mm, you'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. Alright. Uh, tends to have no respect for rules and other people's lives. Anything but their own desires, which are typically selfish and cruel. Alright, so technically, y'all can eat people. Yay! Yeah. Birdman! Um, um, are you. Well, hold on. Birdman, are you gonna eat people? Well, to be fair, my character is chaotic, good, but he's inside the mix of good and neutral. Neutral. Uh, Never, individuals uh, their own heart, generally. I mean, technically, I guess you can eat it. As long as he doesn't see anything violent. Yeah. The ball is Never, the Islands, number things turn from good to complete anger and hatred. Yeah, so all three of y'all could technically eat people. My, my, my. Alright, so. My birds are cannibals. Oh, I'm not saying no. I. Yeah. Alignment is a thing in the game, so if we start doing something that shouldn't fit, I try to make you change your alignment towards that direction. That's why I was just asking. Oh, uh, okay, that, that makes more sense.
Yeah, and God's gonna have to be like, nah, that's not your alignment. And Paladin boy over there would have been an oathbreaker, but we're good right now. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm chaotic evil, so I knew off the bat I was gonna be able to eat people. Yep, so y'all are good. So technically, yes, y'all can eat people, but the party, the party, because uh, I'm pretty sure we're all too, they look at y'all very strangely. Yes, you do. Bro, I, I, can't, I can't really say shit, because I do something. They don't know that. Are you telling them, Roko? <laughs> I'm not doing that, but... Okay, so I then you really look at them differently. You look at them and yeah. what the group looks like. No, I don't really care that much, so yeah, cool, whatever. They're eating no. No, no, no. Alright, so we're gonna cut these gnolls up. I'm a, I'm a professional butcher. I, I can do it. Uh, perfect. Uh, and make sure you, uh, you know, preserve it. Uh, do you have any salt in that in that uh cart over there? Do you I, have any salt in there? I'm pretty sure the the heat alone can uh, dehydrate it by itself. No, that's fair. <laughs> All right. Now that the uh food situation is solved and we have fresh water, now what's the plan? Like I said, stink, stink here for a little bit. Delay. Right, so, uh, Time to? that's what I'm asking, and then, yeah. So, first, I would take a rest and then suggest to just stay there longer, yeah. right? Is that, is that what we're agreeing upon? Yeah. Uh, All right, so, yeah. well, after the first day, how many hit dies are y'all rolling on day short rest? How many hit dice? Uh, oh, oh. For uh, Leo, well, I guess Leo wouldn't know what that is. So I saw eight hit dice. Yeah, you you start with eight, but when you take a long rest, you only get half the hit dice back which you spent, and for every short rest you take, you gain hit points, but you have to spend out of your pool, and right now you have eight in your pool. For hit dice, uh, Leo. Oh yeah, but I'm 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 fine. I'm like full health anyway. All right, well then, Bird Birdman and Leo need to decide. My health points are. I don't do the neck. Uh, I know. I don't. I don't know what my my health points are. Well, it'd be. Uh, Bird. Yeah. Birdman and hit. Um, Birdman and uh, Zerg is uh, low on health. Yeah, Leo sacrificed his L to heal Birdman and Death on the Null encounter. So, Leo took... Don't, don't worry. Uh, I'll pray for him. Oh, boy. And he, he'll go uh, and um, put his hands on uh, Zerg's uh, forehead and start to pray. he be like, oh, Mother, please uh, bless him with... Uh, some health for now. Some health. And, and he would like heal for, uh, how much HP you at? He, I don't know. I don't know. He took, uh, uh it was like 20 hit points away, or 40. Well, it was 19 to, for, uh, 10 HP. It was, it was 19 the first time I remember, and, let me see if I had this. Well, I did necrotic, that necrotic hand. Oh, okay. Hand. So he did 19 first time, 7 bite, and, uh, pull, but he gained four, so minus six, uh, twenty six minus so minus twenty two. He's minus twenty two of his hit points. Then he also healed death. Uh, a, no, he healed uh, what's it, a birdman. Uh, the other. And that's how he ended it. So. I got healed too. I remember. Uh. Yeah, I healed him too. God dang it! Oh no. Uh, so that one was wrong. I have an HP out of 48. I'm 
Yeah, that was pretty good. Just have to start. Okay, so uh, I'll I'll help for fifteen and and be like all oh, my dad favors you. You know. All right, will you write down who how many hit, hit points each person gonna you're gonna give them? I'm only giving uh Zerg HP. Oh, and okay. then just fifteen. Oh, fifteen, no Leo, gotcha. Be right back. I'm not getting a drink of water. Now you're right. Alright. So, Leo, you held some, but not quite in what you need. But, uh, do you spend any hit dice or no? Yeah. Yeah, how many? I guess technically. Uh -huh. What? Uh, let me see. Can't believe. Information. Okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Uh, proficiency description. Roko, what's what's a cleric's uh head die? A D eight. All right. So, Leo, how many uh, D8s are you going to roll? And then you add your con to that. I mean, what's the max? Eight? Yeah, but... T yes. Eight. But, uh, eight would... Oh, what's your con? Because you also, you also get your con. Con, con, con. Con is plus two. So it's a D eight plus two every time. So you gonna use all eight? Or how many? Yeah, gonna... I'm gonna use six. Okay, so six, um, two, three, four, five, six, plus twelve. Plus twelve. Yep, plus twelve. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Oh, no, not like that. Hold on. Uh, there you go. Which would heal two of the uh, transferring health plus the 15 he healed you. So 15 plus 6. So that would put you exactly at full health. Nice. Yep, they're back to full health. Oh my goodness. Alright. So, after the first day would pass, then y'all would suggest to stay longer, right? Uh-huh. And, uh, that would hear the discussion and tell you, no, we made an agreement to... Make well, this trade happen. Well, well, come on, man. It's not, it's not a full stop. We're just delaying it slightly. D delaying it how long? Well, let, let, let's say, let's say, I want to wait for five days. How does that? Five. And five days. All right, so we're all persuasion then. Oh, fuck that, man. More persuasion. Well, I have someone else rolling then. No, I'm rolling. I'm rolling. You get advantage. You got the rest of the party. Okay. Ah, bite me, asshole. Oh, shit. Yeah. Uh, I, huh. I guarantee I'm not going to huh. win that one. Huh. Silly Billy. Ah, uh, damn. Alright. So, I need five days. Anything beyond that, 
is unacceptable. Okay, fine. Yeah, five at least five days. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Why'd you say at least? Now you're changing it. Fine, five days. Five days. Max. Oh, what? So what? About it, no, no, no. We're making sure we're on the same exact page. Okay, five days. Five. We'll stay here for five fucking days. Five <laughs> <laughs> Don't be so hubby puppy now. Uh, we're on a, we're on a deadline, and you and you can't just not, change not, the not terms. Not really deadline. Not really deadline. We're just bringing the ship, bringing the ship to them. Ah, you say that so he would walk over to you and show you the stone tablet and point to it. Dead lie. So it's, it's not if, if we were to oh you know get locked in the, the desert storm, who would who would have known? Right? Uh, well, then they would pronounce us dead and put bounties on our heads because he would know if we're alive or dead. Both of them. Oh, something to think about now, huh? Actually, what, what would they do? Because it's not, it's not, it's not really a crime to get, you know, get lost in both of them. Because then we would owe them money for something that... Oh, yeah, we'll pay back them. We'll pay back them. Oh, yeah, Beth. But how do they know that they were not criminal criminals and just stole the shit? How how those know that no 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 really die no fucking sons? Uh, they don't. So it would just be one of those that they live forever and and uh, have a grudge that some people stole their stuff and never came back. Exactly. I'm not so about you. I like that part. What part? You know the plan where we steal a merchandise and not bring it back. Oh, okay, let's not do the Whoa, 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 whoa. We agreed that we're trying to make friends with them to be. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Friendship. Yeah, we're making friends with Zio. Fucking nobody. Not Leo, it's Zio. Not Leo. Uh, no, no, that's a Zio, not Leo. Yeah. But yeah, friendship over here. Friendship, not turn around and ruin them. Yes, yes. People. Anyways. Exactly we get for being friends with them. Because next time we go through that, we're not, we're not, we're not, we're not, we're not fucking start next time we go through that. They're going to allow it. Exactly. Our customs, yeah. our, that you would say our customs are, uh, they'll supply you with food and drink, but, and a place to stay. You're just not and, allowed um, to, you're just not allowed to live there. I, I forget what is the uh, agreement that we came upon about the you know money. Was it uh sixty, sixty uh forty? Sixty forty. I wanna let's see. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven times five, fifty-five percent. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Uh, that's fair. Fifty-five in our favor, right? Yes, in your favor. That's why I had to do the math real quick to make sure I was doing Okay. Well, yeah. I just have to, have to make sure. Uh, you had to make sure. I had to make sure. Yeah, so it goes 45, 55. Oh. Okay, so. Right. So, y'all are going to stay up to five, five days as an agreement. During that time... Because this is your opportunity to put your token anywhere and take advantage of it. Yeah, so. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, let's get, let's get comes to top. I put fucking all of me, my kids, you know? Yeah, but I'm just, all I'm saying is you can put your token now anywhere that way. If you do the time skip, then I know yeah. where everyone is. <laughs> And if another disaster happens, it ain't on me, it's on y'all. Um, I'll go... Just hold, stick the middle of them. Oh, you're gonna go... Um... What? I, 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 I like swimming. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. Oh. Not gonna manage Yes, Guess you. I'll just, uh, be in a cart. So you're going in there and gotcha. I know. Well, the merchandise, make sure uh, nobody like uh, Zer don't decide to drink some. Drink. <laughs> oh my gosh. Stay on top of the cart just to keep an eye on Jadrini. You know? <laughs> I'm, 
I'm, I'm, I'm, I'm at the top of this uh, little, little spire here. I'm looking around. Alright. Yeah. I am just trying to make my life easier. And... Okay, so Birdman's on top. Death is not here. So, Leo. Where's your character going, Leo? He muted himself. Water. He's playing in the water, then. I said that he'll play in the water. Alright. So. My, my, my. What a wonderful dress. Alright, so. With let's see. So yeah, we'll do it like that. So uh as and it only took one extra day, so it wasn't that even that bad. One extra day. So one day passes. Uh -huh. And off in the uh, northeast direction, heading your way, so northeast to southwest. Yeah, because he's going towards you. Yeah. Uh, towards you. Towards you. That direction, because you're obviously they're going to the water. Uh, you yeah. see a lone traveler. Uh, mm -hmm. heading towards you, but. Super far away. Be sure to shoot anybody you see, uh, Anya. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, y'all can roleplay it before he shows up. I don't mind. I'm just... Uh... Shoot anyone to see. Okay, I'll go. <laughs> uh, well, evil. Just, just cripple him. Not, not kill them all the way. Oh, you know fun. Box, do you have any suggestions? Lost the brother. What was about the brother? Holy hell. Alright. Well, Is it okay for the characters to sing? Yeah, your character could sing. Okay. Yeah. On Legend. Alright. When you can. Okay. So you, uh, so Roko's keeping watch. Birdman is singing on top of the wagon, and Zia's making sure the inventory is still accounted for. And Roko, or uh, Leo, Leo, is was typing. Leo, are you good? Uh, I guess. No one. Where does your character want to go? On the island. Island? What? Uh, what island? Is the, is, is the island? It's a, it's a obelisk. I don't, I'm at the top. Oh, okay. Yeah. You gonna go on top with him? Uh, yes. My gosh, a one of her singing. I thought the the dwarf community had enough of your singing. I think you just. I just think. I think you just broke glass. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I want to do. It. Yeah. I think. I think great. I got a hero. So why do you have a one? You got to tell us why. What does that mean? What do you want? Yeah. I stood up onto the vehicle and just plumped right onto the ground. Oh. <laughs> That's funny. I didn't even got a chance to sing. I just wait. Was he was he rolling to sing? Yes, and he got a one. Oh That's... my god, bro! Sing is, look, mate. Singing's just not your for you. You need to give up your career right <laughs> yesterday. I'm not worth it, mate. 
Ino considers shooting him for a horrible performance, but decides against it. Oh <laughs> my the, the performance isn't even worth the lead, mate. It's just the lead. Oh. I thought he learned his lesson in the Dwarven community. Look, how do you, how do you, you not a bard? Is this not what your career is? How do you mess it up this bad? Yeah. If the if the last one was the mating call, what do you call this one? <laughs> this. This this is attack. This is fucking attack mode. Yeah, this is what kills you by shooting shooting shots at you, breaking shit and shit. Uh, shitty shitty shotty, shitty shitty, shitty bang. Uh, yeah. Maybe maybe he uh managed to get some of uh, the uh merchandise. Merchandise. He's screaming in your ears. He's screaming in your ears. What merchandise? Okay. Uh, Clearly, uh. In a drunken slumber. <laughs> mm, yeah, so he's, he's stealing right. booze, can't you? Gotcha. I'm staring. I'm staring at this, at this lone traveler. Yeah. So you see a lone traveler up in the distance, no, okay. Go, uh, going Zeed. up, going up sand dunes, down sand dunes, up sand Zeed dunes. Does, Zeed, there's one. There's one man coming towards us. Well, you don't know if he's a man, you just know he's a person. Hey, right? One bloke coming towards us. Zeke, there's one guy coming towards us. Should I, should I shoot or what? <laughs> shoot. Oh. Uh, does... Do he look, uh, or she look, uh, threatened? I don't know, they look, they look like a traveler, so I don't, I'm not sure what, what to shoot him uh, she, uh, she first asks questions later, what I always say. But just give a warning shot. Death would tell okay. you that everyone should be treated as friends. You never know what they they might have in store. Uh, 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 those friendly gnolls came by and killed four trees. Four, they killed more than four. They killed five trees, but like six trees. So Dead, yeah, two, three, like three, four, murder, five, murder, six. That's what he would say. Mur bunch of murder elbows after that. Well, yeah. I was, I was asking, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. That's, that's what I was asking, man. I was wondering about what you do, what you So what do you think, what do you think, Leo? Should I shoot or not? Uh, fine. I'll go check him out. Hold on. Uh. And if I, he, uh, if he do something yeah. weird, then we'll shoot him. Okay, yeah, you, you, can, you can check him out. Wait, who moved the wagon? That was my fault. No. No, you're right. So while all this is happening, I'm butchering uh, the dog people. That, yeah, I got you. The gnolls? Yep. Yeah. Which yeah. way the person it's coming? From the, it's coming from the 2 o'clock. Oh, I'll go that way. Yeah, so you gotta meet them over there as they're coming your direction. Yeah. Actually, meet meet you meet them at two hundred feet. That, that's my maximum range. Two hundred feet. I uh, can't go no farther in this map. The max is one hundred eighty-five where you are. Okay, don't mind them. Just meet, meet them maximum. Wait, well, I want to test something. Now that I think about it. Um. Was it? Well, you gotta tell me what you're rolling for. Yours, okay. I made a mistake putting a space into to it. Instead of like um, one d twenty, I did one space d twenty, which just made it one. Wait, what are you talking about? What are you trying to roll? I'm just testing it this time. Oh. Mm. I don't know. Uh. All right, so Zio, how far are you going? In uh, that direction. Of the northeast. 
Um, about uh, two hundred feet. Well, there's only hundred eighty-five on the map. Well, from well, where Rocco is. Hundred and sixty-five. Hundred sixty-five. Uh, see that is one, two, three, four. All right. There you go. That's where you want to go? 165 from Rocco? Yeah. Alright. Uh, anyone else want to move their characters? I know you are. Uh, Birdman, did you want to or are you staying there trying to sing? You have to imagine that they're coming the this direction, but there's only so much room on a map. Okay. Are they like thirty feet away? No, there are There are a lot, lot more than that. Okay. Well, I'll try to. Like, travel that direction. Oh, uh, and, like, uh -huh. fly towards, towards them. How many? And then about ten... <laughs> no. I would say about ten yards. So, 30 feet from Zeo, or 30 feet from uh, the mysterious being? Mysterious being. Uh, and ask friend or foe. Friend or foe. Who knows if it's friend or foe? Alright. Uh, Alright, so. Uh, he watches Birdman's flapping his wings and in that direction. ZL taking your advice on staying in your gun range. Uh, Birdman singing and flapping, doing his best. Uh, you begin to see a mysterious traveler, uh, covered up, trying to not expose as much skin as possible due to the sand and stuff. Uh, and the individual would say, well, I would say friend, but who are you? As you would recognize a scimitar, a scimitar and a longbow. You know it's quite rude to uh, ask who people are without introducing yourself first. Well, I'm just a lonely traveler traveling to the sands. And the same as us. Looks like y'all are hostile. No way, no way you see the slogan. No way you see the slogan. No way. I'm not saying you. I'm saying why the fuck would y'all greet him all the way over there? And why'd y'all wait until he's at the fucking oasis? Y'all went to him like, bitch, stay away from my water. And he's just well, thinking. Well, yeah. If he was going to turn the water into. Well, complete death. Wait, who's gonna turn the water to complete death? If we don't, he might. He might try to poison the water. Uh, me? I'm not poisoning the water. I, I live out here in the desert. I don't, I don't know what you, Grim. It's it, it, it possible. <laughs> okay, that already happened, and that wasn't supposed to happen. Y'all did that. This gentleman <laughs> is trapped, and he tells you that I travel from... Oasis to Oasis, and my f family, I don't know, community, community. My community uh, roams these deserts for hundreds of miles. Yeah. Uh, can I, can I uh, do uh, insight to safety line? I mean, you can if you want. I don't know. Yeah. Let me see. 
thinking I'm lying. You'll know if I'm it's lying. True. I mean, you can if you want. That's what I said, That's if you true. want. Jeez, so... Um, I just don't trust your DM at all. I'll never trust anything I say. Oh my gosh. Yeah, apparently he's really lying. No, he's not lying. Oh. Oh, I, I, have, my, I have my doubts about you. But me? Why me? You're the one come to me. I'm the one go to the water. Uh, the water contaminated. What do you mean it's contaminated? It's contaminated. By who? Uh. Oh, hold on. That, that, oh, sounds like you did it. Oh, uh, no, of course not. No. I, I would never do such thing. Uh, sure. <laughs> Why'd you pause? The water definitely... The water definitely contaminated. You might have to go to the next oasis, which is, I, I heard it was uh, west from here. West? Well, first of all, you got to roll deception now. <laughs> you better, you better just start rolling deception because he already told you he lives here and his family owns hundreds of miles. He knows where every water source is. And you're saying there's a new one? I said, like... That's am nine. Why my road so whack today? Yeah, uh, he might fail too. I don't know, but I have modifiers. So yes. Uh -huh. uh, so he and this is the funny part. Uh, well, how do I want to do this? How do I do this? How do I do this? How do I do this? Uh, how many times can I do this in my? Okay, I tell him that. It was, but now we have cleaned the water supply. Wait, but the he best. just, he said it still is poisoned and have to go west. West. I know, but we tried our best to clean the water supply. From some dog folk. Mm. Sounds like. One's telling the truth and one's telling a lie. What are we going to do about this? Oh, he, he put his uh, hand on his sword. What you mean by that? Oh, oh my gosh. Uh, this is... You would see... He would, he would get bigger. And he'd look down at you. Are you trying to start something? Of course not. Uh, <laughs> I just... Uh, I think it might be too big, but it still grows, though. Uh, yeah, there you go. Mm, okay. I feel threatened here. Can I roll for a... You feel threatened? He's the one being threatened, and you're saying that you feel threatened? What are you rolling? Oh, my God. Persuasion. Can I roll for a persuasion? To what first? To try to calm him down. Is the one that, there's no calming down when somebody has their hand on a weapon. Okay. Uh, well, let me put it like this. If you if if you want to roll it, you can. You can uh, um, if, hold on, hold on. So you can roll it, but just roll it with a minus five. Because I think I have a good idea. One, twenty. So why are you being why are you being so hostile? Just just take him to the water, bro. <laughs> I know. <laughs> God damn, he's still sucking and rolling, but he's still passing. All right. So now he's hostile. Now he thinks y'all are both hostile. Oh wow! Oh, <laughs> uh, hey, uh, hold on, I'm about to jump. I'm gonna jump in. That's it. Uh, Just to lower his weapon, I'm gonna take his hand off of his weapon and to calm this what? new NPC to calm down. Uh, so do you, does Zio let you as uh, Roku drops down and starts Roku? I mean, not Roku, uh, Leo. Leo, it's gonna take you a moment, but uh, I'll say, like, three passes, and then you can join the conversation. Okay. 
uh, Zia, do you let him... Chester for you not to be hostile. Uh, I, I'm gonna just, uh, keep it, like, back away and be like, you got it. Uh, it's, it's clean. You scaredy cat. Yes. <laughs> well, then, lead the way. Because I'm not trusting y'all behind me. Right. Uh, follow me as I fly <laughs> towards the watery hole. Oh, uh, fine. Uh, I, I would like to, uh, yeah, I, I just walk. <laughs> I'm going to like, and I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell the guys I might kill this guy. I don't know. What? And He's going to hear that. If you say that. He's going to hear that. He's too big. He's keeping the pants with you. You told him to go. Oh, He's going with you. I don't. Why? Why are you so fast? Because you. It does. Look. Oh, well. You're moving thirty. He moves thirty. You move sixty. He moves sixty. Okay. <laughs> no. Uh, I'm gonna just go to my merchandise. What? And as I like the water right there. I know you know your way. <laughs> Scaredy cat. How does he move so fast? What do you mean, how does he move so fast? Do you think monsters have a lo slower movement speed than you? Unless you've got mo- What? Unless you have the mobile feet, he's gonna keep up with you. Exactly. No. <laughs> Your tone of voice. He's he's keeping up with it? Yes. Yes. Alright, so... He would walk over and, uh, let's see if he notices you real quick. God damn, he doesn't know. No, you don't need to. Alright, so he doesn't notice you. So, he would say, uh, uh, I don't see the water contaminated, but I see the trees are dead. Yep, they are completely dead because of the wolf folk. But we have helped the water supply. I appreciate that. But uh, we could. Well, it is a vital source out here after all. Y'all are gonna be quiet, little mice. Uh, Leo, are you gonna say anything? Yeah, I was, I was, I was waiting. Oh, okay. So, I guess I'll just go down and be approaching them, and then when I got there, look at the new guy, uh, look at Leo, look at Chicken Nick, and just be like, why did he turn big? <laughs> and, uh, what the hell took y'all so long? The big man would look down at you and say, "He he put his hand on his weapon." Well, why are you why are you why are you threatening the people? Why are you threatening people? I was just making sure he don't poison the water that uh, we so kindly clean. You're did, the one. Did he not introduce himself? You're the Mr. one, Mr. Tall Guy. Did you introduce yourself to this man? I told him I'm a lone traveler, and he stated he poisoned the water. Why, why did you say you poisoned the water? Uh, I didn't say I poisoned the water. He just assumed I did. Really? You said the water is poisoned and I have to go west. I said the water was it's contaminated. Yeah. Oh my god, brother. This <laughs> guy. Okay, okay. okay. Uh, new. Sir, just give me a second. He, he is cracked. The water was contaminated. I'm <laughs> Some I I don't know what what they're calling this, but people like dumb people. They, they did contaminate the water. He cried about that, but he had some, some looking glass that he poured uh, that he water, and it's been good ever since. It's clearing up. He couldn't save the trees. It was a matter that died. 
but uh no um if you need some water it should be good to, to, to drink um you know help yourself uh, mur- maybe these murder hobos calm down got some food um, oi what some good fish my brother Murder us. So you're saying that y'all just killed everything you come across? Whoa. Only if they deserve it. Ah! Uh, 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 uh. Oh my god. Well, it's bounty, bounty wise, or you, you try to kill me by the end. You're hostile. Good. Hostile, y'all. Y'all were the hostile ones when I got here. I agree. I agree. Uh, tempers have been cleared, but we just got out of a out of a fight, so we didn't know who you were. And so, this is like the whole types. Is that so? Uh, I don't. Think... I have. I have church dues at the morning. All right, man. Have fun at church. Yeah. Uh, see you. Everyone, see you next week. Yeah. Thanks, Joel. Thanks. Oh, oh my God. Hey. We don't. You don't have to answer to him, Zerg. Yeah. I may. I don't. But at the same time, it's nice to have friends. We don't know this guy. He doesn't know us. We're on his land. It's only common courtesy. I don't think he's noticed me. I don't think he's noticed me either. <laughs> no, he has not noticed you. And y'all are saying y'all are a bunch of killers. And that you're, you're saying that if they're hostile. But the problem is y'all are hostile. So he's pointing out that maybe y'all are the hostile ones and they're trying to defend themselves. Who is y'all? It was just me. They are... No, uh... you... Leo, Leo said that if they are hostile, y'all kill them. And he's pointing out maybe that y'all are hostile and they're defending themselves. And so y'all think they're being hostile, but in reality y'all are the ones giving the persona of hostile first without realizing it. Does that make sense? Indeed. Yeah. Anyways, no, no, I'm hold on. Before you agree, I... it's easy to say you agree, but I'm making sure y'all agree and everyone actually understands what I mean. Instead of just agreeing with the grambling. Well, so far, they are, they are seeing the hostile so far. Yeah. I, uh, I, uh, they, I am not, wait, Zia or Leo? Because Leo no, has no, been No, you specifically stated that if anyone is hostile, y'all kill them. He's no, just... I said, any, I, I said, yeah. if you go against me or the people that are... Like, that are hostile. If you try to kill us, then we will kill you for before you get the chance. But you said that if they're hostile towards you, then you are hostile towards them. So you would kill them. So don't be hostile. But he's pointing out that, like, because a perfect example, Zio now. Zio put his hand on his weapon. So to the, And y'all don't realize that. And technically, I wouldn't realize that except Birdman now. Uh, that they, whoever the new person is, or right, well, will say right now the dog people, the dog people automatically are just defending themselves because, quotations, Zio puts his hand on his weapon without y'all realizing. So in the rest of y'all's eyes, y'all are thinking, oh, we're defending ourselves. But in reality, Zio point, uh, makes a bad impression and they're defending themselves. That's why he's pointing out, are you sure you're not the hostile ones and they're not defending themselves? I, I, get, I get what you're saying, man. I do. But at the same time, you got to look at it this way. If, if they're stupid enough to still engage in, the, in that fight, then it's their own fault. They had the chance to turn away and run away, but, but they, they didn't. So that's that's still hostility in my book. It, it, it... They had their chance. Exactly. You had the chance to turn around. You knew what it was. Murder. Oh, well. No. If, how, do you, how do you give somebody the chance? Do you tell them to leave? 
It's of not course. A, uh, mm -hmm. running out, running the drinking water. Really? You really saying that you give all creatures the opportunity to leave when you start attacking them? If you knew that we were going to fight when you saw that weapon be unsheathed, then yes, it is your responsibility to take in the fact that you have the chance to run away. Just like in real life, if you come in, in my house, you had the chance to get shot because you had the chance to not have to come in the house. You had to cross a lot of borders in order for you to make that decision that you're going to come inside. That's the same logic. If you made a lot of decisions for you to come and attack me when you seen that I have a sword, you made that decision. You could have turned around and walked away, but you did. You, you continued. So you got stabbed in the face or shot in the eye. And he's saying, uh, well, okay, then he would point out that with that logic, what if they're coming to give you, they're surrendering, and you killed them? Don't do it. What? Then lay down. Just. I don't know continue. that. I'm they, still taking that as as a hostility fact. But they don't. Still, you are still approaching me. That they, is your own decision. They you don't. They don't know that they're supposed to lay down. Some customs would believe, uh, that being a bully, they would give you their belongings and walk away respectfully. And you're saying that if they still come towards you, you're going to kill them. How do you know which is good and which is bad? Well, see, we have a saying, right? Are you ready for the saying? <laughs> Fuck it up, I know. <laughs> no, man, that's a good saying. That's a really good saying. No, no. It's, it's kill them all and let God sort them out. That's the saying. God. My gosh. You're... He just steps back. Oh, no, just in case you get struck by lightning. Uh, no, you're saying that it's not that you can kill as many people as you want and have no consequence oh to it. Oh, my God. No, no, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is if I consider you a hostile and you continue to come at me or the people that is in this party as a hostile, then I will do everything in my smite to take your fucking head off your shoulders. And That's I, what I'm saying. And I'm telling you, there are beings out in the world that will give you their belongings respectfully and then walk away thinking you're trying to rob them. And so how... you're trying to say you'll give us your belongings. No, but that's not what I'm trying to get at. I'm saying... Okay, we, we're, we're focused way too hard on this one. Okay, look... <laughs> What do you want? Why are you here? I am here to travel my land out in the surroundings and check on life itself. Okay, so what is your, like, history to this land? Like, do you know any way out of the desert? Because I, 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 I want to get out of here. No. This shit's somewhere's big. No. Ask him why he's big. <laughs> Ask him why he's big. No, Roko, hush. And no, he doesn't know the way out. He told, he told, well, I guess he, in, he told Zio, and as you were walking up, because again, it took you time, he told Zio that it's hundreds of miles of desert. So if he knew a way out, you think he would be here? Well, how the fuck would I know that, mate? No, I'm, I'm bringing that up as a question to you out of game. Uh, well, I don't, I don't, I don't know that. Yeah, I guess that would make sense. But I, I mean, it wouldn't hurt to ask. I mean, <laughs> all right. Yeah. But so yeah, so he would tell. If his family has been in this land for thousands of years. Then he should know that if there was a way out or not. No, it's not thousands of years. But I get what you're saying. But he would tell you that we live, we live, we die in the desert. Well, that sounds fucking pathetic. Pathetic? No, it's not. So, yeah. Uh, he, so he is. Does it look like he's backing down? Then you he's know, not backing down. Him. He looks. He just sees Birdman fucking trying to defuse the situation, which everyone's ignoring him now because technically he left. Uh, Zeal's got apparently nothing to say now, and Leo's being the bully, trying to look at the giant. Do you, Do you are you hungry, mate? Do you want some food? We We got food. You want, you're hungry. Uh, well. In my culture, we are the ones that are, what do you call it, what do you call it, hospital? hospital? Yeah, hospital. 
we are the ones, but someone over here is uh, not so nice. Even though that people are not nice, we still believe in treating everyone equally. Listen, mate, you're really getting under my skin. I'm asking if you want food, and you're not very answering the I'm question. I'm telling you he, that he's the one that normally gives it out. No. no the, not the other way around. Uh, what? He's a traveler that travels the Zio. desert and helps people. Zio. 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 Where, where's Zio? Somebody find Zio. Zio. He's next to you holding your hand. What is it? Can, can you make sense of, of this man here? I, I'm trying to offer him no. hospitality and he spits in my face. I did. How am I supposed to respond with this? He's not spitting. He's telling you that his job is to wander the desert and help those that are in need. Right, okay, that's great. Do you, are you hungry? Do you want no. food? Can we help you? No. Okay. Well, nobody need help to help around here. You could go yeah. on. <laughs> I want to still to be over here. Uh, then roll still. Yeah, I've been you... waiting for him to, like, snipe this man for the past 20 minutes. I've been, been thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Like, I knew you were. I knew you were. I was thinking to myself, like, man, this man's been, like, snipe this man. But Ro I was about it, but like, it was so dumb to stop him, so I didn't. Roko thi like, thinks that as long as he's talking, there's something he's, there's something else to be told. That's why he hasn't exactly, done it. Yeah, exactly. He's got, he's got, he's got something to give us. Awesome. Well, yeah, I mean, I've been waiting for him to say something, but... So he did, but he's telling you that he, him and his community own hundreds of miles of dirt, sand. They believe in traveling from a way... Well, he, not everyone. Some of the members of the community will travel from place to place, and if they come across travelers, their custom is to believe to help anyone out there because again a desert is a help me write the fuck up out this desert but he's not doing that right now i'm ex yeah because he told he's saying that he lit he only knows of hundreds of miles of desert that is his all right so like uh some of the creatures they only go a hundred a mile from their house well he's going hundreds of miles from his house and Again, it is all desert, all of it, hundreds of yeah, miles. Okay, yeah, I, I, I get that. All right. But, yeah, that's all right. And so Gee. he tells that it is his custom when he finds weary travelers, no matter if they're evil or good, then that means he's neutral. That he helps them with food and water to continue their journey. That is his, that's what he believes. He's not, he's not good, he's not bad. Alright, so, uh, what kind of supplies you got, Mike? Supplies? I know he tends, he tells you that he has food and water, just, what do you need? We need food. food. Um, but, uh, I will finally speak up, and so, uh, I think we need both of it. The, all three of them got their supplies <laughs> fucked up by those gnolls. <laughs> so, three. Uh, let's see. So, he had to look about a. Uh, let's see. Because I have to see on this stupid spell what's first. Um, Alright, gotcha. So you're saying, all right, all right, all right. So again, so you're saying that some of the supplies got ruined due to some dog people. Yeah, they 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 they, see, they, they, they the reason why things got so fucked up with the trees and shit, you know. That's weird. Normally they don't contaminate. No, it's weird, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, they don't contaminate the source. They are. They just believe in killing everything and walking away. So for them to contaminate the water is strange. 
Yeah, that's pretty really strange. But, uh, like, we can have a feast if you would uh, choose and, and talk stories. Sounds good. Sounds good. Mr. What's your name, by the way? Just call me Nomad. 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 Okay. That's that's what that's what that's what the cryptic of you. <laughs> I'll walk away and go back to my uh my fire where I'm cooking cooking the meat. Uh, how you making uh fire with no? What are you doing? Burning? What are you burning? What do you mean what am I burning? Dead tree. Burn, 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 burn the dead tree, mate. Come on. Yeah. Uh, what's up? What, what is our merchandise again? Miscellaneous crab, the door pass. Yeah, can you give us like a list, mate? Oh my gosh, it's miscellaneous stuff just to survive. It doesn't really give us a list. Oh, so we sell in merchandise to survive. Duh. Well, it's, it's more... Uh, I thought it was like booze. It, there's booze, yes. There's booze and food and random ass trinkets that will... Y'all will consider trinkets, but it'd be like furniture, but I call it trinkets due to, I mean, y'all don't fucking have an, a house, so it doesn't mean anything to y'all. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, no, man. Would you like to buy some booze? No. No? What booze? That's, that's one of those strings we're trying to to drive booze. Yeah. He would, uh, lay out a, uh, a rug across the ground, I guess. Whatever. And what he would do is he would. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Savannah. Where the fuck is Savannah? Uh, he would slide his hands uh, forward and backward, forward and backward, and then say, Enjoy this feast that shall be uh, bestowed before you. As. Uh, 45 pounds of food and 30 gallons of water on the ground. Uh, you, you use magic though, right? Well, uh, magic. Magic. What is magic? Well, how, what, what else is this free to free home from? It is a gift that was uh, bestowed upon me. It's just. Oh, whoa, 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 I mean, they do literally just need food. I mean, and water. That's kind of cool. That, yeah, I guess so. I mean, hey, do you have any books for sale? I have books. I don't have books. I mean, if you want books, you're gonna have to go to my community. Your community? community. I'm not telling y'all. Y'all are hostile. I'm just here to. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> no, no, fuck those guys. Uh, what? No, no, stop. No, fuck those guys. Okay, I'm just like reading. Okay, I, I, I was dragged into this mess. Whoa. Yeah. And y'all better I'm start rolling some deceptions on lying or dragged. Well, I mean, I'm technically not lying, though. Uh, you're not dragged. Yeah, not... You're no, right. I, I don't align either, Grim. I don't, 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 don't align. What do you mean you don't align? You traveled with them, yes? Yeah, but I don't, I don't allow, allow them their views. And did you not, or Leo, and did you not state that anybody that comes towards you, you consider hostile and then kill them? If he takes them as hostile. Yeah, if but they're hostile. When they, when how they do you know, but the thing is, how do you know if they're hostile or not? That was the whole thing I was trying to explain. Now what? I don't know, this food is poison. What? Yeah, exactly. You're saying yeah, that, that this That's exactly a good point. You don't know if you're hostile. You're gonna say that my food is poison? I don't know. Well, we, 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 we what is what? You are. Yeah. You asked who I was. I gave you a name, Nomad. I tell so, you. Can you could be lying? Question mark? <laughs> then roll, start rolling deceptions of her insides if you think I'm lying. Well, yeah, but, 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 I I can be your I can be your position, right? I'm this traveler that travels around the desert, and I, and I see four adventurers. They get huh? I can make some good money by sending like, their stuff. 
But I, I'm going to kill them by, by, by giving them poison food under the pretense of being generous, you know? Did, did you not watch me summon the food from the there and I choose to fill the role, so you still know he's telling the truth. Okay, um... Uh... Yeah, but that... But big big feeling under no, under nothing means that it doesn't... Of course. What do you mean? I just... It just came out of thin air. I literally just... Wait... Yeah, that's bad. I... Yeah, that's, that's conjured, magic. That's day. I conjured something out of thin air. Uh, and conjuring then. and manipulation of the forces is still magic, sir. Yeah. <laughs> something out of nothing that's and right. you want something from me you want to go to my community when you say uh, I'm just murder hobo you created something out of yes nothing i got that, this that I, is considered magic i get Andre this of the, of the dark arts is considered magic uh, it, and is punishable by death in this in this country i'm dead it's say not death. i'm just explaining to you he, he looks he goes down to one knee he says it's not death in this community he says it's sold into slavery. What the hell are you talking about, Death? Well, would you like to be sold into slavery, or would you like to die a free man? If you live for nothing, you'll, be, you'll, you'll fall for everything, mate. He's clarifying the... You're not supposed to kill the sort of matter. You're supposed to sell them. He said kill them. He's clarifying and telling you the only way you're going to make money is by selling them. Why would you kill them? Yeah. Maybe because I have my own personal thoughts on it. You, you don't know me. All I'm what saying is, you are admitted you kill things, and you automatically assume people are hostile. He is hostile. I haven't killed anything in this whole thing. I haven't killed not one thing. Let's see. How, do, how can I take your word for it when you have three stinky heads back there? Well, I, well, actually, Mr. Nomad, if, if, if nothing else, Mr. Nomad, I would actually, actually do a small favor. I'll listen, but it doesn't mean I'll do it. Well, well, <laughs> I, I haven't done anything half what you've so right? Yeah, but when you travel as a group, you're treated as a group. That's what, that's what, that's what, that's what the prejudice of you to your It's kind of prejudice as hell. Says the one that stated, your comrades uh, stated. I'm not my, I'm not my comrades. Yeah, I'm not my comrades. Okay, okay, okay so I'm, you're, I'm, so you admit you're a murder robo and you admit that you like to start fights. And he can't say. I, hold on, hold on. So these are the titles he's going to be giving y'all. Murder hobo, starting fights, or what do you call that? Short tempered. Short temper, uh, kill things just because it steps to them, and can't sing. What is Ralph? What, what was mine? <laughs> Kills things. Wait, 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 how do I lose temper? I was, I was no, what you're not. Zio is short temper. Oh. Zio. I, I haven't killed a single thing. No, I'm not. No, I know that, but how you stated that if a creature steps to you forward. And it's okay to kill them, even if they are trying to give you treasure of what they think that is value, even though you might consider a crap. You still kill but, them, even though you don't even I, really know their true intentions until they're already dead. But anyways... Now, anyways why are you laughing? Uh, exactly, you made my point. You're a murder hobo. Okay, Roka, what? I, I, I got this book, actually. I, I was wondering if you could be heads or tails. A uh, book. The, the magic book that I got off the corpse. What oh, book you say? That you got off the corpse. Wait a minute. The book you had. The book you had. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, what about it? What do you... Do you make, do you make heads, heads or tails of it? I don't really understand it at all. What do you mean you don't understand it? This book. This book. I hear you, book. but... You show him the book. And he starts using his big fingers to look through her and goes, I don't know. I never uh, met this person. I don't know. I don't know. Fucking useless, right? Useless? How am I useless? He asked me a question. I answered it. My, I... I wasn't talking to you. Uh -huh. I wasn't talking. You took it out of context, man. I'm talking about <laughs> this fucking weather. Okay, this weather Okay, Oscar, so you, so you don't know, but but you, do, do, you know, do you know anyone in your community you might? No. 
No. Oh, that's a shame. Well, what you're is, at... What is he do? Because the reason why is because he doesn't... He doesn't go to people's community. He doesn't go to towns and villages. And what... And that person must have been an adventurer. And so we didn't want to know about him. So, so are what? you a shapeshifter? What are you yeah, talking about you shapeshifter? Can, you, can, you can use magic, can you? Because you're bigger, first of all. <laughs> Secondly, you can, you, can, you, you can just be in food repair the thin air. So you can use some sort of magic user. Yeah, I thought he said shapeshifter. I didn't say shapeshifter. I mean, you just you literally fucking made yourself 20 times bigger than what you were supposed to be. Like, what, what the hell? And? Are you a jinn? Could you be a jinn? <laughs> what are you, mate? What are, what, what, what are you? Oh, I look like human, don't I? Look like yes. all the other travelers around, don't I? No, you got human, you know. Yeah. I don't know. What do you mean uh, you don't know? When, when was the last time that humans could, could, like, you know, morph themselves and create food and water out of thin air? I'm... Well, aren't some gifted? Oh, so, all this food is ours? Yeah. yeah. It only lasts for 24 hours, but... Can I, have, uh, can I have the carpet? No, you can't have the damn carpet. What? Should I? Uh, how am I supposed uh, to leave a plate? How, how is he supposed to, uh, like, if he summoned this food, you want it all dumped all over the damn sand and it all get dirty? Well, I didn't ask all that. I, I just asked for the carpet. And that's where he likes to place his food so it doesn't get dirty. And be... Just go get a new carpet. I'm not go, I have to travel all the way back home to go get another one. I'm not getting another one. <laughs> what gets traveling? You're telling me that's, to leave. You, you said yeah. that you help, yeah, you help leave, the, leave the man alone about his carpet, mate. Just yeah, let him I, have his carpet. You've got it, man. You've got it, man. You've got it. Yeah, I need the carpet. Man. What so do you... Leave us food, leave him. You don't you need... need drop it, man. <laughs> Can I do an arcana check on the carpet? There's nothing fancy on the carpet. He, you yeah, can I roll, can look, roll, roll it. But he literally showed you, he showed you you could cast magic because you cast magic. So it's like, why are you thinking it's the carpet that's doing it when he's the one who did? He, he, he don't know how to cast well, yeah, magic. No, I'm Most saying you know, know that you can cast magic. I choose the fell again. The carpet is not magical. I'm telling you. That you know you can cast magic because you see what magic looks like. Uh, the rest of the party does too, apparently. No. So everybody knows no. that he can cast magic. So that's all why right, I'm. All right, mate. all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Look, look. Is all there right. any information of any kind of value that you can give us? Anything at all? Yeah, food and water. No. Fair enough. I'm gonna I'm 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 go grab. What, what's, what's, what's the food that he made? I don't, I don't know. know. Apparently, you only last for twenty four hours, though, so you might want to gorge yourself while you can. No, I'm just letting you know that out of game, that's because that's how the spell works. Um, my, my bad. My bad. Nah, I only say that. Oh uh, yeah, just you're supposed to just imagine you have this grand ass piece, like you're having a party. Yeah. That's what he's trying to say. You have a party. You're you're safe for another day, and it's a party. You have, you can have a party with this big guy, or not, or tell him to fuck off and leave, and well, you. Could you, could you not be so big, mate? Uh, I could. Can we just eat in the carriage? What? No, I mean, no, the carriage is only, the, the carriage is only the size of a small person. And it, though, like, barely the door fits. Everyone else has to crawl on their hands and knees. That bit look huge, but okay. No, it is huge. It's an RV for midgets. It's an RV for midgets. <laughs> the midget RV. What? 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 what, what, what uh, Minotaur. Oh, I put him in there too. He's. They're all in there. I just. Oh. Okay. If there was gonna be combat, I had them hiding. Uh, oh. Uh. Well, I should probably tell him to come out and eat, but. <clears throat> but what? Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna go tell him to come out and eat. Right. Some weirdo out here. Uh, weirdo. Water. <laughs> you shouldn't be able to hear me. Oh no no no! Hold on, let me hold on, let me reset something. Weirdo! I can't believe you said weirdo. Uh, um, Mister, you hold on, hold on, hold on. I only get two hours on that one app. Hold on, Mister. 
All right. So now, what are you trying to say, Mister What? Mister, can you can you imagine yourself? Okay, fine. Whatever. Who cares what I am? I am a person that travels this the land and helps those that need. What do you need? That's great. You might be a, a good guy and everything, but you're not very doing us a very good favor. I mean, yeah, you, you gave us food and water. That's great and what? everything, but I done told you you should like let us go back to the community to get the fuck out of this desert, but no. No. Maybe some of them can, but no. Murder hobo, uh, short-tempered, and can't sing. That's three strikes. Yeah, but I'm not thinking about it, right? So, still Not yet, but it's still part association. How does it go? Uh, when you're with. Yeah. It's about yeah. to go with my foot up your ass and you as my fucking slave, mate. That's what it's about to be. Okay, you, you, you're clearly a magic user. You're not being a very good guy and you're kind of pissing me off. Sorry. So, I'm going to give you this count of three to start packing your shit and showing us where the community is. Otherwise, I'm going to beat the fucking living shit out of you. And there's nobody that's going to stop me because you're going to be a slave. That's what this magic user is. So, if you don't want to get your ass beat and you don't want to get your fucking face smashed in with a brick, then I suggest you start goddamn walking and show us where the goddamn community is. Do I make myself clear? And death will tell you, shut up. Okay. Okay. I, I'm done. I, I'm, I'm done. You know what? You guys deal with this guy. No, I said you. death. Death. You remember death? I, I know. I know. I know. That's why I said I'm done. Oh. Was it some other? Was it other person that hasn't you know pissed him off yet? I think I'll talk to him by myself. Yeah. I'm just making. I'll just walk away. I'm going. I'm, going I'm not trying to be a dick to you, Leo. I'm just making sure. That I I, just... no, 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 I get it I get it <laughs> like I'm not I'm not getting a dick vibe I'm just I'm playing along man it's something. Uh hold on. I'll do the magical. Okay okay so uh y'all are gonna feast and whatnot. Yeah they're inside the fucking caravan or whatever. They're not gonna um, fit in it. The only ones that fit are these I'm... two. Just those. It's it's literally not. Bit. If I had to, I would have to show you all the map next time. I have to show you what the map looks like. It, it looks like it's being it's being big enough for me, Mike. It is literally for midgets. <laughs> midgets, damn it! You don't know. You don't know my height. Carpet. There you go. Are Why you are you mean, moving everyone? No, I'm not a midget, but still. They, the, the short people Why, can eat. Why am I being pushed around like... I'm trying to make everyone act like it's a stupid carpet in the middle, and <laughs> y'all keep moving my shit. And I'm not moving. <laughs> y'all I believe it's not a magic carpet. It is not a freaking magic carpet. <laughs> Mm, it is not a magic garbage. It's, it's, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like Aladdin, mate. Aladdin. What type Aladdin. of uh, degen don't have a, a carpet? A degen? What's a degen? Magic. I just told you. I'm just a worry traveler. Do you have, do you have a lamp, mate? Do you have a lamp that, that I can... I can no, what lamp? <laughs> no. Oh my gosh. Y'all really think he's a genie, don't y'all? I mean, it's not. Oh my god! First of all, y'all wouldn't even know. The only one, the only one that even knows about genies is this one because he actually used one in the Dormant campaign, and he would have told he y'all don't know what genies are, and he hasn't told y'all that he's a genie because if he was a genie, he would say, "Hey, he's a genie," because he's used to freaking wish before. Just make. If I was able to meta game, I would ask him. He's, I'm telling you, he's not, uh, if there was a genie vibe, he would say there's a genie vibe. Y'all check that the carpet is magical. The carpet is not magical. Y'all is can, the food magical? Apparently, yes. The food is magical. Uh, Mr. Nomad, uh, what? In your, in your uh, city, do they have uh, magic carpets? 
Oh, magic bar bed. <laughs> What do your city even do then? Uh, How do they make their money? Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, finally asked a somewhat intelligent question for this person compared to anybody else. Uh, what I'm meaning is like, so he would tell you that my community travels between dimensions. Dimensions? Or oh. planes, whatever you want to call them, but I consider more dimensions. Oh, yes. Which so one? we. Which hold on. So we go through four different portals and collect things from four different places and bring them here. Okay. Why do you do that? Why? Is it, is it a, is it a service or something? Why? Because yeah. that's how we survive. Hmm. Okay. Fire. Would you recognize, would you, you recognize, would you, would you recognize this then as I'll show him my gun? No. No? No, no we don't. More importantly, if y'all travel to different dimensions, what makes this your land? Because this is where we're born. Mm. I don't trust them. Ah. Huh. Okay. Look, so you can see the carpet is fire, water, earth, and wind. So it is magical. No, I'm trying to give you an example. Like an image. Like, you know those... uh. Uh, I don't want to say a quilt, but in America it'd be a quilt. Everyone else would have, like, images on fucking blankets. It's a story, but not really a story, but... Oh, the Avatar. Sure. Yeah. It's trying to represent the, the four elements of D&D. Oh. You know, the yeah. elemental plane of fire, the elemental plane of water, the elemental plane of wind, and the elemental plane of earth. Oh. Did you ever uh, heard of uh, void magic? It's a it's a element. Uh, the ethereal. Is that about the ethereal? Uh, sure. No, I'm asking you. Is that what what you're referring to out of game? Yeah. Then yes. <sighs> Interesting. That's how you get to well, go. That's how you have to travel uh, from one plane to the other. After all. Yeah, I'm gonna grab a. Uh, Chicken leg. And, uh, look at uh, Chicken shade. Leg. Wow. Eating bird in front of bird. Gotcha. Oh my gosh. Bird in front of bird. If if you didn't come, he was on the list to be eaten. What? This is exactly what I'm saying. Why you cannot go back with me? Huh. Oh, that don't mean. So you have bird people in your city? No. None then yet. I think they'll be safe. What is? <laughs> That's not, now I'm saying is you eat intelligent people. Intelligent, you well, know, humanoids. Well, humanoids. You're well, a cannibal. You? You're a cannibal. <laughs> He's saying you're a cannibal. Them or us? So you're a cannibal? <laughs> My gosh! Are, I'm you, just... are you saying if you were stranded, with only? Uh, a bird person, you wouldn't eat them? No. Uh, then I guess you would die you with your uh, pride. My pride, sure. Well, well, well actually, guys, how, how can you recall, how can you recall no as humanoids? They're, they're fucking monstrosities, aren't they? No. They got a brain, they can talk, they can communicate, they can steal. They just like to kill for fun. Huh, yes. I don't know. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I refused to eat. Mm. Yeah. No. I, I was actually cooking food at the moment. Cooking. Uh, or I was about to start cooking food. It's pretty good. Well, you don't trust, trust mine. Me. You don't trust mine. No, it's not that night. It's just uh, at at the time I was already in the process of butchering and 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 uh, starting the fire and such and yeah. What do you mean? I don't really. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm already eating, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm not there, so you know. So y'all are eating, Roka. What do you want to ask him if you're gonna walk away from the party? Apparently. Well, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just sitting there chilling, talking, talking to him, you know. Okay, so what are you gonna ask him? Yeah. yeah, so, so you don't, you, you don't know recognize my weapon? No. Surprisingly, surprisingly, with someone who walks different, different dimensions. 
Uh, yeah, I walk from the elemental plane of air, water, fire, and earth. Like, uh... Oh, okay. Wait a minute, my god, what? What's your question? Uh, never mind. Okay. No problem. But, um, okay, uh, you... So, why, do you, do, you, do you visit other other parts of this world, or just this, just this area? Like I told your friend in earlier, I travel hundreds of miles throughout the desert. Just, just the desert, yeah, nowhere else. Unless I travel to the other plane, which is earth, fire, water, earth, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Oh, well, well, well we're heading to our human village. Do you want to come with us? Village, it's a town, but... No, 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 it's town, I mean, human town, will you come with us? Uh, a village is human village. Uh, I don't really do too good with uh, crowds. Oh. Uh, do, you, do you appraise my items? Okay. No. No? We can get uh things that are enchanted. Yeah? Do you, do you reckon you can, you can enchant my gun? I can't do it. I'd have to take it somewhere and I'm not taking you there to get to get the gun fixed. <laughs> no. No, but uh but so, but, so, but so far, I've been, I've been the most amicable. Uh, guilty of association, murder hobo, short temper, and can't sing. Oh, well, I, 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 can be, I can be the voice of reason. Uh, okay, nice then what's your voice of reason? Taking a murder hobo and a well, short temper. Cannibal. Well, I, well, I, well, I'm the well, I'm person to make sure, he, make sure he doesn't fucking kill more than, that's, uh, more than allocated. More than allocated, but your friend already stated that there's no there's no guideline that if somebody steps to y'all, y'all just kill them. So what is considered allocated? Well, it didn't win self defense, right? It's if, not self defense if, if, if they're trying. Oh my god, it's going well, back. Yeah, if, if, you, if you do weapon, yeah, that's that's self defense. But that's not what he stated. He said because then that's like saying the Knolls drew their weapons; they didn't draw their weapons, so that one doesn't. The, well, I, I actually did. Did the noise do 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 weapons, guys? Did the noise do weapons? Or killing you? No. No? No, 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 no weapons, the noise? No. But they, but they, they were still attacking with claws. And... Ah, but uh, but it doesn't. That's not what the point you're getting at, though, and what Leo was getting at. This is what I'm trying to say. How do you know if they're hostile when they're coming toward your direction? Right. Ah, see, now you understand what I'm getting at now. Mm. There is... But it, it was because of them that, that the, the, the area did get fucked up. Maybe so. What we thought is a very hostile uh, approach. And even if it won't be hostile, they still, they still did attack our, 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 our buddies. Uh, are you sure yeah, they, they, did... they poisoned the watering hole. Are you sure they didn't attack first? Who, who, who for us, guys? <laughs> I did. It was me. Did you? One hundred percent me. See. Oh fucking god. To be fair, to be fair, all right. If they would have came any closer, that watering hole wouldn't be <laughs> saved, mate. It wouldn't. It wouldn't be hit. So yeah. So so so, 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 so technically, we're we're actually self self defense of of the of the um. Of oh. the preserving the water hole. But it's yeah. also nature just taking course on. Let things live and die. Why are you defending it? I thought you would be... Neutral. He is neutral. He is neutral. He sees balance in both. Neutral. I'm just saying, though. I mean, it's... it's If we didn't do it, then the watering hole wouldn't be here. And you, you, you wouldn't be able to travel from Oasis to Oasis. Mm-hmm. So, if, if anything, you should be thanking us. And... Instead of judging us, <laughs> he wasn't. Because that's kind of a douche. That's kind of a douchey thing to do. I uh, mean, you don't even know us, and and you've already put labels on us. Like, you, why would you do that? It's not. That's not. That's not very appropriate. Like, you, you just you, you just assume things, and, what do you mean and that's assume? not better. Where is he assuming? We deserve rewards, like <laughs> your. Uh, we're, we're fucking heroes. What was the fucking coffee so much, man? What was the coffee, man? He's not. <laughs> I just, I, just want, I just want a carpet. Man, I will what give you want? two gold pieces for that piece of, that, that piece of cloth right there. No! 
five gold pieces. No. Fifteen gold pieces. No. I don't even think it's worth that much. Oh, well, I wasn't buying it for me. <laughs> I don't think it even worth that much, though. I mean, I, mean, I really wouldn't. I wouldn't piss yeah, on it. There's a way that we could keep the carpet. No. I mean, we can keep him as a slave and. You know, ergo, own the carpet, but you know, you guys, you, you guys aren't, aren't with that plan. So, you know, hey, I don't know. Mm. I'm, I'm not very big on keeping magic users as slaves. Selling them probably, but keeping them as slaves, that's fucking stupid. I, I agree, 100. percent I'm just saying, you know, it's that's that's the world we're living at this moment as magic um, users and slaves. So, yeah, and I mean, technically, we're good to my association of working in that, in, that, in that area, but I personally, I don't, I don't really care if it seems or not. I... And he doesn't see it yeah, in the back. I'm gonna go over here and start talking to this head that's in, over here, and you guys have fun. Well, he doesn't see it as a bad thing, he doesn't see it as a good thing of uh, owning slaves or killing people, which is the way of life. Alright, Leo would walk to his bag and pick out a head and, and just sit there and talk to it. Magically or non-magically? I mean, if I do it magically, would they know that I'm doing it magically? Probably not. I think they're too stuffing their face and, and trying to interrogate that I must be lying about something. I'm actually not even going to be talking to the head as a head. I'm going to talk to it as that invisible demon thing that's that, that's always with me. Okay. So you can talk to the invisible demon instead? Yep. Oh. All right. So, what is the question? So, what's your question? Who? Well, do you have a question? No, I was just gonna say that. Uh, say everybody else in the party, it just looks like I'm talking to a head. Yeah. But I'm, I'm just I probably wouldn't think nothing of it. I always thought you were kind of weird collecting heads mm. in the first place. <laughs> So, what are you trying to get out of this, uh, gentleman standing before y'all, other than his carpet? That's what you're wow. <laughs> Other than his carpet. Um, outside his carpet? Can we take his shoes? Oh my gosh. He's gonna strip you naked, Leo, and make you walk. There you go. Is that what you want? Can he be in front of me naked? I what said, you're going to be the one naked, not him. Why would Leo be naked? Because he keeps trying to make him take his clothes off now. Shoes, next thing. It was thing. just the shoes. It was, yeah, exactly. And shoes becomes the next thing if he said yes. And then the next thing becomes the next thing and the next thing and eventually he has nothing. Oh, why are you assuming again? Uh, Where's with the assuming? It says assuming. the person that wants to take his carpet and the other one wants to... Okay, well, technically, technically, Graham, uh -huh. us as the player gets to decide how the story goes. You as the no, no. DM decides I... if it goes that way or not. I'm not saying but no. technically, we could make this thing yes. into a fucking sex slave if we want. Not saying that we want uh, that to Yes, happen, technically, yes. Yes, technically, yes. I'm not saying no. Glad we had that talk. So you, your shoes? No. I'm gonna roll for intimidation. Oh my gosh. Yep. <laughs> Roko, what's your question? Other than um, no, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just chilling. I'm just chilling. Just chilling like a villain. Yeah. Because this guy is not going to give me much else. I mean, I, you know, I'm, I'm trying to be nice to him. And, like, you know, we can trust because you be. <laughs> yeah, we was trying to be nice, but then he didn't want to give me his carpet. What are you talking about trying? You, so you put your hand on your weapon. Right. Yeah, because he, he was like, oh, are you trying to do something? I'm like, what no, that's not what you're trying to do. That's, that's not what happened. But that's no, I'm going to be honest. I'm gonna be honest. If this works, I'm gonna I'm gonna roll for intimidation on him taking us to his compound. Oh my god! You can try. Let's go. Let's see the shoes first. 
I'm I'm looking for the, the pin. Leave me alone. I'm looking for the pin. Are we just didn't kill him already? No, we can't just kill him. That's that's rude. Who would know? God would know. <laughs> oh yeah, the all mother. Intimidation intimidation is a plus one. Plus I was looking one. for it. Wait, no, 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 no. That's not the right character, my boy. Yes, it is. Yours is the no, furball. Fur. That's not him. Yes, it That's is. Not him. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. That's two different character sheets. Look. No. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, you are the furball death domain cleric. Yes, I know that. It's Zurig. He's a celeric. He's a death domain fireball. Yes. Furball. Yes. Verbal. Verbal, yeah. Yes. Okay. Just, but and, on D and D, yeah, it's plus one. Yes, it is. Intimidation plus one. Verbal cleric level eight. That to me. Got a lot of HP. Yes. How much HP you got? Oh my uh, gosh. Well, you know, me, but it just the fact that you have that much. He, he, he might have he might have maxed it out, I don't know. But what I'm saying is um, plus, one. plus one. Yes. Okay, I'm, I'm plus one. Plus one. Plus one. My gosh. Ah <laughs> uh, come on, baby. All I have to do is beat a one. Just beat the one. All I gotta do is be the one. All I gotta do is be the one. That's all that matters. I just gotta be the one. Oh, man. And then Leo shits himself. <laughs> yes! Yes! Alright, now, can we have the clothing dropped? Alright. Fine. Fine. Now, being serious, y'all want to go to his combat. He's telling y'all, fuck y'all. Y'all, as uh, two players, gave bad impressions. Yeah, too. Out of, out of the rest of out of the rest of the party. That's like, that's like a minority. Of I can't help that. That's where the story went sideways. Oh my days, man! <laughs> so what are y'all going to do? Even though Suppose we uh, got off on the wrong foot. <laughs> and yeah, I... and uh, you wore us. Uh... Quite kind to even give us this banquet. I I apologize for my behavior earlier. Mm -hmm. But do you actually mean it? Of course. Uh, I I'm still a little uh soured about you not letting me have your carpet. No. But I can look past that. Uh, my name's Zio, and he like extended his hand out. Well, for flavor's sake, let's see a persuasion to see how. Actual, sincere you are. Oh, you want me to do persuasion? Yeah, for flavor. Uh, I'm actually quite good in persuasion. Let's see. Yeah, the flavors which starts kicking people's butt. Oh damn you! Fun? Yeah, apparently you are sincere. So he would pull, put out one finger, so you can shake each other's hands. That's, that's quite. Weird Not that bad. He, as uh, the one talking to himself, uh, openly admits that uh, y'all kill people. And uh, he I, uh, admits that he eats smart people. I, yeah. I can admit that I have slewed my share of people, but it was in self-defense and... No, no. Well, he talks and he points to the man talking to Ed. Yeah, but he's he's uh, kind of crazy, so you can't, you can't give him too much. <laughs> yeah, really? look at him over there, talking to nuts, talking to his. Yeah, he's kind of nuts. I get that he's crazy. We can all see that, apparently, but still. So you can't give him too much shit, you know? What do you mean he can't do shit? He tried to steal my take my shoes and make me uh, bow down to him and take my shit off. Okay, yeah, but and he, no, yeah, but okay. see, no, see, every time you say a but, that means you just made his point. Listen, man, hold on, hold on. You said you, you do dimensional magic, right? I didn't. Technically, yes, he does. But. Um, can, what? Can I, can I, what? Can I, can I, uh, can I roll for arcane?
Mauritania. What are you trying to ask him, though? I mean, I'm not trying to ask him anything. I'm just trying to uh, narrow down what he could be. Are you trying to figure out what he is? Pretty much. He's human. You literally see a human. Okay, but, I mean, I can... I want to know his magical traditions. I want to know what kind of planes of existence he can use. I want to know the inhabitants of those planes. I did say what what planes. It's earth, fire, water, earth. He even told oh, Roko. Those planes. You just named four of them. Yeah, so. he, he specifically told that to Roko. And Zeo asked okay. if he can go through I dimensions. I want to know the inhabitants of those planes. Fuck, you don't like, even... I, I want to know more of that history. He doesn't know and, that. all that. Well... I can. No, I'm saying he doesn't. Can. His assignment is just to travel. You have to go to his community if you want to know the information. Like that's why I'm that's sorry. why I keep telling y'all. His job is to travel to look for people. His job is not to go back home. Okay. Well, do you well, un- well, hold on. I, I don't want to seem like a dick. Hold on, Rucka. Do you understand what I'm saying, Leo? Yeah, I mean, I, I get it. But, okay. What I mean, do you mean? What do you mean? Say your butt. Tell me. It's the. Arcania thing, like I, I, I would like to make this role to get to know, like, not only what kind of magic he has, but like to know what inhabitants of those dimensions that he, he he's possessing. I mean, I'm just trying to to know more about this guy. Yeah, he might be human, but we didn't know he could fucking make food out of nothing. So I want to know what else he can do. And with an Arcania check, I would have that ability to do that. But the only one I can tell, I think, is Zeo with... Um, no. Arcania ability is... Arcania messes it, with... Uh, uh, your intelligence check measures your ability to recall lore about spells, magic symbols, magical traditions, the planes of existence, and the inhabitants of those planes. Yeah. I get you. Okay. I'm just telling um, you. I'm just telling I you. Measure his ability and recall. Uh, lore about disposal. Is the lore about what disposal? Yeah, because I'm trying to narrow it down to to a more. I want I want to know more about him in a subtle way, and the way I can think of is if I know more about his magical uses. Like, okay, he created food and water. Okay. Yeah. But he also fucking walks dimensions. That's cool. I like that idea. Uh, I want to know more about that. Um, I, we've been stuck in this desert. I thought this would be a way that we were going to progress through the story. So if we were going to do that, I wanted to know what, like, the, everything, the lore about it. I want to know the lore about what's going on with his abilities. Just Does that make sense? Just asking. I know. I, I think I got what you're saying, but at the same time, it's like something when you start rolling arcanas to to ro- roll across something that you've heard in history or came across your past. And he, yeah. he, he's telling you that he's born here, which he is born here, which he also tells you that he goes to all four dimensions. So I'm trying to tell you it, the four elements make him, that's what I'm trying to tell you. And I'm trying to tell you that he won't know the inhabitants of the other planes. Because he doesn't travel to them and you wouldn't have heard any rumors about that. The only rumors that you would have heard were about dinosaurs and animals that talk. Is what part you're from. He's from a different part. And the magic he uses is... I mean, obviously he changes shape and makes food, but... Really, that's it. Right. You understand what I'm saying? Like that, I I think what you're trying to get is something that your character would have never even came across, not yet. And all the information he's giving y'all, actually he's giving you, because he has nothing to hide. He's telling y'all, I'm born on Earth. We're just gonna call it Earth. I'm born on Earth, but I travel through four dimensions. He could, but he just chooses not to. He prefers to meet new people. And just feed them randomly? Yeah, that's what they do. It doesn't... They think of it as a druid out in the middle of a desert. But he's not a druid. 
But think of it as a, a druid that has the desert subclass. All their job is, is to make sure weary travelers survive the desert for one more day. And then he goes one way, you go another way. Quotations. That means you follow him when he leaves. Do you understand what I'm getting at now? Leo? So be a spy? What? Be a spy? Exactly. Do you understand what yeah, I'm saying? Okay. I'm not trying to be a dick on the Arcana. I'm telling you, you wouldn't have heard the information and he doesn't know about it. It's not his job title. It's yeah, I got you. Okay. Does that answer your now? Yes, sir. And it doesn't sound like it in the tone of voice. Yes, Graham. That answers my question. Uh, Thank you. Uh huh. But does that answer the rest of y'all's questions on? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Like, okay, so, yeah. Yeah. He want to bring me. He don't want to bring us to his uh town. Community. And we're and we're stuck in a desert right now with. Well, y'all think that he get. It's not that you're stuck in a desert. You have to think of it as the planet is the desert. And even okay. he would agree upon your suspicions that if you were if you let's say you were born on this planet. And maybe you came from a different one. If you were born on this planet, all you've ever known is desert life. Okay? Now, uh, and if you weren't born on this planet, obviously you came from a different place. And y'all are like, this shit sucks. Like, why the hell did I come here? It sucks. Yeah. I mean, it does. Being on a desert planet, it sucks. And he is agreeing with your, uh hypothesis on if you did come from a different world and you've been thinking man is this nothing but a desert planet and he's telling you openly for hundreds of miles so you're looking at two or three hundred miles all he's ever known is desert so to his eyes the planet is the desert and to your eyes it just seems like it is never ending sand they don't got no camels? Yeah, and uh, towns do. But that leads to another story of there was a headless horseman that killed all of the travelers from different nomad tribes and human settlements and blah, 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 blah. And he killed them all out. Accidentally. Kind of. And so trade has stopped between the dwarves and the humans. And because of that, you wouldn't see any more livestock. Y'all are the ones bringing back trade. So y'all can start seeing more animals. Y'all are the the new frontier. How did we sign up for this job? <laughs> well, I think I'm more of Roku kind of signed up for the job, huh? Oh, well, Anya is the boss. Oh, whatever. Uh, yeah. mm. Mm. Okay, uh, we appreciate the meal. So, there's a reason why you, st oh, why are you still here? What do you mean, still here is a question mark? Like, he's not gonna go anywhere, he's staying the night. Oh, because there's carpet. Because he put food on the carpet and the f He's staying where his carpet is, and he's staying the night. He's, if you choose to stay another night with him, or do your own thing. Do we have a tent or something? Technically, yes. Oh, I have a tent? Let me see. I don't think I have a tent. You almost got questions. Y'all better start asking them. Uh, oh, um... No, I'm good. So, in your, in your town, uh, do they uh, sell any good merchandise? Sell, strong word. Sell, sell, sell. I guess it wouldn't technically be selling. It'd be quest. You have to do something for us to get something in return. 
Okay, and is there something we could do for you to get something in return? No. Y'all are, y'all are bad. Nah, I would like to call us, uh, entrepreneur. If you say entrepreneur. Uh, entrepreneur that eat smart people. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Nah, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Who did we eat that was smart? Oh my god, the gnolls. Oh, we didn't no. eat them. Yeah, we didn't eat them. Anyway, so technically, uh, oh yeah, he's in the Oh my gosh, but still. How would he know? How would he know? Because you said that you were cooking the gnolls. And I never said I was cooking gnolls. Yeah, I you... said I was cooking meat. I never said it's no meat. Well, yeah, true. Yeah, true. And you said you were messing with it on top of the, the obelisk. Yeah, but you didn't see me though. No, not you. I'm not saying you. No, I know that. I understand that. And Wait, I'll... you didn't see me. I, I jumped down like three three yeah, things before I know he, that. he even took me. I know that, but he's also taller and he can see on top of the obelisk. It's oh, not man. that high. What is he, eight feet? Technically, we consider the giant right now, but normally he's a medium. That's like seven something. So. The sizes are weird for D and G. Okay. But right now he's a large, not a medium. That's what I said. Ask y'all questions while you got. Ask him. So, uh, so if so if you want to take them to the, to to your, you know, community, what what do you think me? Because, like like I said, I've done anything bad. And and I'm I'm obviously not allowed with with those with those other. So you're, right. so you're trying to say that you're just a wandering traveler, while they're the ones assigned to, at a game be traders, you know trader T R A D, E, R trader. Oh no, I, I'm I'm I was saying yeah, I'm with them, but I don't I do not align with them in B or whatever. Then why would you travel with them? Because because it's dumb to talk, to talk by yourself, you'll die. <laughs> I travel on my own cell. Yeah, but you're clearly strong if you use magic. <laughs> I can't use magic. Uh, maybe so. <laughs> what? So, why are you laughing? I argue that his, his arguments are valid. Right now, I understand. Yeah, they are valid. Watch. Yeah. He's just stuck with the with cannibalistic and likes to start shit situation. Well, well is that is that or give myself and get fucking killed by some random in the middle of Buffalo? What do you mean? Not necessarily. Did the last time you met a friendly no? Oh wait, I can't. I can't think of one. <laughs> <laughs> That's another fair point. I never met a friendly knoll either. Mm, exactly. So, uh-huh. you know, you know what I mean. Uh, a, 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 not to mention a lady going out, going out traveling by herself. The lady. You know, that's kind of. And it's survival of the fittest after that. What, what, what do you say? Survival of the fittest after that. Mm, yeah, but. Uh, <laughs> You know, uh, um, to to even the odds, I'm traveling with this with this band of miscreants. Miscreants. Indeed. So, you know, you know what I mean. Besides, I do I do want to get this book looked at. So, and I'm a gun looked at. So yeah, I would not like to see your community. <laughs> Are you trying to just get past this to get to the point, Roko? Basically, I want to be taking C's group. Well, then roll persuasion. Okay, fine, fine. What? You're... What? We're just going in circles. You're asking the same. No. Only y'all are asking the same questions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think Anya is going is going to pray, kind of. <laughs> 
and cause guidance for yourself. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Hear my words, I tell you now. They're crazy, and I'll keep them in line. Yeah. 25. Yeah. Uh, that's right, asshole. Yeah. What do you mean, asshole? He's not an asshole. I heard you. I heard you. He's not an asshole. No. Zeo threatens with the sore. And Leo threatens with his words. And says that they gotta die if they step to him. I don't consider that an asshole. I consider that somebody trying to be cautious. Yeah. So. So what he will do is you uh, want to go into my community, and mm -hmm. I would like something done. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is that are I'm you a, agreeing? I'm a, I'm a marksman. I can't do. I can't do much for you other than shoot. If you say so. So, you scratch my back, I scratch yours, so that means you do a quest for me and you're good to then. Alright, what's your quest? Uh, try and... mm. A quest, a quest, a quest. I guess I'm going to get more with the me. Um, you have to find a undead figure and you have to kill them. Okay, so we just, we're just gonna go out and kill a fucking undead. Not just Fuck. any undead. What undead is it then? There's, there's only a rumor that someone is out to hunt us down. Magic users, yeah? No, he's talking about the guy that was invisible. Oh. Do you not remember that, Roko? Yeah, yeah, I remember that, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say, to piece this oh. together. He's telling you somebody's trying to hunt him down. So what did somebody tell you to go over there and hunt him down? Yeah, you know, it's kind of, it's kind of funny that because we because we were told by some by something to come, come over here and check you out, you know? Check us out. What do you mean by check us out? Well, check out this area. There might, might be some, some, some surprise for us, and you seem to be the surprise. Surprise. So. <laughs> Are you trying to scare him? No, I'm being, I'm being, gen I'm being genuine. <laughs> okay, real good. Yeah. Surprise. So, I, and when you're done with the task, I will deliver you a map, and you can head in that direction. But so first, basically, go back there and kill Mr. Invisible. Okay. No, remember, Mr. Invisible... Leo would have told... Leo knows Mr. Invisible is not there. Leo knows that Mr. Invisible has been following y'all every time y'all kill shit. The question is, does Leo tell you that every time y'all kill shit, somebody's been eating the bones and marrow and what remaining flesh that's up to Leo? But, uh, Mr. Nomad will leave and then come back. Yeah. That's what he's trying uh, to do. Okay. So he's gonna make his rounds, and then you'll come back. And if you completed the, the quest, which means you better have proof. Yeah. And then he will. Okay. So, we, so do you do you do you for us then? Because I can't work with just what do you need? Nope. No, I don't have any leads. I just know that somebody comes here and. Every so often sends people to come kill us. Great. How is he supposed to know uh, if he can't see the person that was invisible? And y'all couldn't see the person invisible. True, true. So, what, do you get what I'm saying? So, if there's any of our future adventurers, he sends them over there. They all say the same thing. Uh, an invisible person. Or an invisible, alive but not dead being. So how can they give a description if he doesn't have, if Mr. Nomad doesn't have a description, if any other travelers have no description? Do you get what I'm saying now? Okay. So you're asking for something that can't be given because no one's seen him, seen it, it. Right. 
So I, I guess the best, way, the best way to do it, Moba, is to have stay here, right? You're basically, you're basically a walking beacon for this, this household. Well, unless uh, Leo, would you have told them about the bones and shit? Yes. All right. So then. Okay, so, 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 I mean, I mean, we just, we just killed three, we just killed three gnolls, so I guess we just, right? Technically, yes, but I'm more trying yeah. to make y'all, like, purposely hunt down orcs or gnolls in the desert, kill them, and yeah, bring them back. Yeah, so you know what, let's, let, let's go on a bit of a hunting, a hunting trip, yeah? Yeah, that's, I love, I love three, I love three things I'm, that's what I'm trying to get you to do, out of game. You know, bait, bait him, bait him. Which means it gives y'all the opportunity to complete the quest and deliver the good. Yeah. So I say, yeah, okay, might as well. Does, any, does everybody else agree, though? I want to give it. Killing Mr. Visible. So what's the plan? Basically, kill as many orcs and gnomes we can in the, in the desert. That's not desert. what it was. Well, 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 you know, it is a means to an end. But by killing all those orcs and gnomes, no, 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 what you're supposed to do is set a trap. And since Leo yeah. said that he told y'all that when y'all kill a substantial enough people in a group, so you find a war band, and Mr. Invisible will eat them. But again, invisible. He'll be eating them. So you have to find so... an invisible person eating dead people. What's the sum? If he's eating dead people, what's the problem? Because he because Mr. 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 wants to eat Mr. Nomad over here. No, he doesn't you know? eat. Yeah. Sure he says he won't try to eat us. Well, I thought he only eat dead people. I guess you're right. No. Nope. Uh, I mean, hold on, hold, hold on. on. Wait, this little, hold on, wait. Yeah, no. Yeah. You gonna see if he only eats dead people. Would it not make sense for him to try to get us to die? I mean, he did suggest us to come down to the fucking oasis, and yet we followed him blindly. We don't know who the fuck it is, but we followed yeah. it blindly to the oasis. What makes you think that, you know, he's not going to lead us to our death, and we're going to sort of fucking follow blindly to our death and not even think about it? So, hey, you can't I mean, use enough, uh, like enough heads. You can't use that as bait. Look at you knowing about why I'm collecting heads. It's crazy. Oh, think of it. They give it like it. <laughs> now it doesn't seem like a crazy idea that this guy's over here just collecting heads. But think of it like That's this. Wild. Crazy, but uh, <sighs> hold on. Think of it like this. Uh, why didn't he come for the three null heads when he's looking for a buffet? There's eleven of y'all, so you know you need at least a minimum of eleven things. In a group to call him out to eat y'all. So if y'all is the dinner plate, y'all need eleven somethings. That and also so, so, that's why it came up to like a mask and all those. All, oh, uh, how many heads do you have? Uh, is that... Yep, but he only three. Has, th he has three heads, but yet that's three. I'm saying bodies. That so, it, oh, it, but we need whole bodies. No, I'm saying it has a a thing like he had to. So, you can do it, think of it like this. You collect a fuck ton of heads to equivalent to 11 people. Or, you find a tribe and kill it. Well, he, but he already think we're murderers. Like, what, the, what, is, what is he getting at? Yeah, but the, yeah, but the orcs. Who the fuck are the fuck are, are, are gonna be some orcs? Or no. Yeah, but they're a to an end, right? Oh. But, but, but killing those 11 orcs, we can... We can we can guarantee you that this will 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 live will live forever. Well, not live forever, but live, live a long time, right? I don't think any orcs coming this way into the desert, but okay. No, th but that's not. You're not. Are you questioning as a question, or are you being serious? Uh, uh I'm, I'm, I'm talking in general. Well, cause like you have to think of it. You're at an oasis, so you're literally, you know that savage things. Orcs and gnolls will come to here. You already saw the the gnolls come here. What, yeah. what if we all lay down and pretend to be dead? Or, or we take those bodies over there. 
and we we leave them out in the desert and we let them collect nasty 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 stinking snake nasty stink and then we just sit out here and we wait for the first thing to come by we kill that then we let that body sit out there and then we hopefully by then it will attract a lot more uh uh, hungry, hungry uh, predators, and while that's happening, we sit back and we let homeboy right here snipe whatever the hell comes around. And uh, let's see how many. Uh, the holy knight. Uh, I guess it'd be cat, and I'm gonna say Rocco. They would tell you that there's a guardian that protects the oasis, so if you stay here, you're going to get attacked. What if we kill that? Rocco, you don't remember the stupid elemental winds that come through here every couple oh. of days? Oh, oh yeah. Along oh. the travel. Oh, uh, as, as long as you don't eat your shoes with them, you'll be fine. No, 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 but do you, now do you remember now what I'm trying to say, Rocco? Yeah. 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 So, there's a guardian that, per, that I guess, because I guess Zio and Leo were them technically know. If you stay here too long, something, tw two somethings travel the... Oasis. So it's what you're saying is if you stay here, you have the potential of being. I don't want to say attacked because that's too strong of a word. But. Uh, oh, and, 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 and I'm applying. And I'm applying. As long as we're not easy, you shoot them. No. Yeah. And then on top of that, you also made a deal with death that you have four days to make it back to the human settlement. So, yeah, so we'll, so well, we'll stick it out. So, so we'll stick it out for, for four days. No, well, okay. What I was meaning is, I had a game. What I don't know yet. I really don't know. But what happens if the counter is not on the fifth or the sixth day? So are you willing to split the party? They'll, 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 they'll be forced to fuck off. Then. That, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, right now you're at a dilemma. Do you stay the four days and leave? And possibly get attacked by the guardians. And um, or the or the invisible one. Or well, the invisible one is not coming until y'all collect bodies. Anyone, y'all were the buffet, and you, and you can figure out that the three nulls is not enough. He wants y'all to be dead to eat y'all, because it's like, what's the point of just eating three things when? Y'all in the buffet, and eventually y'all yeah. will die. Yeah, we can we we, we 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 stay here for four days, accumulate bodies, right? No. Not intelligent ones, right? It has. Anything that comes along, there are means to an end. <laughs> cool. I mean, we can wrap cool. up the game, but what I'm saying is, like, it's. It's some things kind of you have to think about now. Because, okay. like, he's going to leave. But he says he'll come back. So the question is, do y'all believe him, not believe him? Or that y'all no, I'm following him. I'm definitely following him. But, what I'm saying is, if you stay, guaranteed you're going to get attacked. But, in which order, I don't know. That's all I'm saying. Hmm. And you made a deal with Dad to deliver the supplies. So yeah, four, yeah, in four days we'll leave. So we'll, we'll see what we can do in four days. If we call, we we'll come back, right? Yeah, that sounds good to me. Yeah, because it, because uh, Mister Mister here did not give us a time limit, so we we got we got the world. And you don't know how long he's gonna be gone. Exactly. So yeah, there you have it. So it's something to think about. So do you have any questions as we wrap it up then? That's about it, really. Yeah. Zio? No, I'm good. I know it's kind of a long, more roleplay scenario, but... Uh, game. That'd be good that gnome in a character. No, whoa, 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 whoa. Blaming the gnome. You can't blame him. He did nothing wrong. He fed yeah, you. Give me the carpet. No. Like the carpet. Like the he wants. Carpet was gonna hurt him. You have to think of it like uh, it's a dinner table. Like he's, that, that's where he put the buffet on. I'm not a cat. 
cares about that. I just want the coffee. So, so you want to eat... I would have been on my way. You want to eat eggshells while you... Uh, I, I don't mean like actual eggshells, but like sand. If, I don't know if you've ever had... Eat at the beach and you always get sand in your mouth. But the best way to save would be eating eggshells. You really want eggshells in your food? Well, there you go. So you want but, to what? But if if but it is what it is in the end. I'd be <laughs> like, okay, thanks for the food, and then uh, dust off the sand, or pull out the eggshell, and call it a day. Oh my gosh! Yeah, you ever seen? You ever seen the platform? I hear what you're you saying. Know? Yeah. Yeah, you know, okay, so yeah, so it's similar to that, like, you'll be like, well, I'm starving, so I really don't care what the fuck it is. <laughs> you say that until you have fucking sand in your mouth. You start crunching, yeah, crunching, it's crunching. garbage, but you know, like, you gotta survive, right? Yeah. Uh, so, I get you. I, I would have ate my, my sand, sand burger, <laughs> a dick, what, what, uh... Cornish pride. Alright. Leo, you got anything? No, I don't. I'm good. Mr. Quiet over there again. Hunting rabbits. Hunting rabbits. Oh, oh, Rocco, you got anything? No, I'm good. Let's go talk to him. Yeah, because I know what time you go. So thanks for joining us, everyone. And Ciao, I'll be safe, bye-bye. Well, yeah. Peace out. Thank you, thank you. Have a good night. Uh, uh, check out some more stories we have, and like, subscribe, follow. Thanks for hanging out with us. Have a good night. Bye.